<laughs> I need to read chat in my head before I read it out loud from now on. <laughs> Cause you know, crispy crunchy and grimace bit. Katie. My Borger Queen. I cannot hold it in any longer. I love Borgers. I crave them. Glizzies are good, but Borgers are life. This is not a joke or pretend. I want my buns soaked in hot Borger juice. No take back, I think I've made so far. Maybe, maybe pickles are my specialty. Maybe I should draw more pickles. Introduce more pickles into the lore of the champ. Sharks are in love. Ooh. I love I love this song. That's one of the only things that I still enjoy about Mario 64. Which you're all gonna find out about my Oh no! That is true, that is how you really trigger Ghost Pepper. <laughs> oh what the fuck is that? No 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 what the fuck is that? No 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 What? It is definitely not <laughs> In what world is toast well, silent? Have you, ever seen <laughs> you ever, have you ever seen Nacho Libre? Yeah. No. Have you seen the scene where he's eating toast? And it's the loudest thing. Oh, 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 oh. Well, see, see, here's Guys the difference. Sing. I eat raw toast. Oh, so you just eat bread? Yeah. <laughs> 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 I don't know why I can't keep my big cock up. <laughs> and kind of, and kind of. I don't care about you or your condo. Then it's not going to be so hard you would get down on your own stuff. Oh. Your mind would try to go play with your sister. Oh. Your sick female relative. Oh no. Oh no. Whoa. this? Is this in the game or did somebody play this? What is happening? Uh oh, somebody died. There's suddenly a dance party happening. I don't know what's going on. Why are we, why is there mariachi music? What is happening? It's, it's garbage. Thank you, professor. Oh, I didn't have a one star. Oh, good. Yeah. Well, the other two are coming. This is where things get sticky and not not the good kind of sticky like a cinnamon bun I didn't know where I was going with that <laughs> and I all I saw was Billy Red's throbbing and veiny I didn't see anything that followed it and anything that that came before it and I was like oh no oh no what's going on in chat this is where I come to masturbate. Oh. 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 <laughs> I'm gonna be completely honest, so you guys know, this is not a confession I should make, but if there's ever like a solid week where I'm like, nah, nah I'm not, I'm not. Some, there's something wrong with my camera. I don't, I don't know, I don't know what's going on. There's something wrong with my camera. Um, I probably accidentally shaved. <laughs> Just know that's a possibility. We'll jump. We'll be. We'll st a stick. A stick. I'm gonna add. I'm gonna add a jar full of marinara a day. To, no, I'm not. No. No. What? Like nothing on my Switch. I really want to play right now. Play um Animal Crossing. I don't want to play anymore. Or did you know that the. The, the new Crash Bandicoot came out like yesterday or today? I did not. The fourth one? The, the subtitle is like, It's About Time or something? <laughs> Which I think is really funny. I'm busy hustling while you're busy working. I'm a real kid. I'm getting to you. You look all shy. Time to get 
<laughs> listen, 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 listen. Listen. <laughs> listen, listen. Listen, <laughs> What don't you understand? <laughs> no, I had trouble. I struggled. <laughs> I str Oopsie poopsie and the train go whoopsie. <laughs> oh no, Sleepy! Sleepy, let me just... let. Please, I, I need I need in your own words <laughs> what is happening in this picture. <laughs> Please, sleepy. <laughs> now I'm not nearly as scared. I also have no way. I lost my soul. I can't go over there. I lost my souls when I died before, and I don't know where they're at. I'm also I'm pretty sure I'm stuck. Pretty sure I'm stuck. What am I stuck on? Excuse me. Guys, I'm stuck. Guys, I'm, I'm, I'm stuck. I'm, st I'm stuck. Alright, there we go. I'm unstuck. I got myself unstuck. I remember. No, no. I can't. Zoe, I can't punch things while I'm carrying you. I'm gonna need you to contribute. This is like when Lily and I play Resident Evil 6. And, uh, and she carries me. <clears throat> Nobody told her I said that. Say daddy's home and so go watch your hentai. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, hang on. Should so so go watch your hentai, not go hide your hentai. <laughs> Daddy's home. Go watch your hentai. <laughs> or should I be like, Daddy's home. So go watch your hentai. <laughs> you you do. Re Papa, I do not wish to fight. We can we can hug it out. He's got big burly hugging arms. Let's just let's just hug it out, okay? I try to figure out what that sound clip was. I was like, what is happening? This feels like a good time for banjo music. This feels like a good time for banjo. Sir! Sir! I'm gonna roll. I'm gonna roll. Oh no, this looks like a bot. Oh no! No, 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 no! Oh no! Oh no! Did you see that? No, 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 no. Hey everybody, welcome on in. Welcome to the, the, the grand return of Pokemon Fridays. How's everyone doing tonight? How are all of you? It's so good to see all of you. It's so good that so many folks are here taking time out of their freaking Friday to hang out. Look at all these wonderful folks in chat. We got Lily. Lily's already catching Pokemon. Or I'm sorry, Lily. I'm so sorry. That's Squovert. Squovit. Not there's no R in there. Squovit. You know what, Lily? It's it's Squovit's loss. It's not your loss because you're you're a fantastic trainer. Squovit would be lucky to have you as a trainer, Lily. That's Squovit's loss. We got Watermelon Guy. How you doing, my friend? We got Miss Yui. How are you doing, Miss Yui? How are you feeling? Watermelon guy, what's up? Oh, Jack, um, Watermelon guy, you might be, you might be pleasantly surprised to hear that I'm planning on picking up the new Jackbox. The, I think it's Party Pack 8. It's sometime soon. So we might be playing that sometime soon. We got in, gamer. You're here for the Pokemans. Yeah, this is exciting. This is the, the grand finale 
of our also i need to change hang on i need to change that we're not we're in we're in the fourth the fifth round now i gotta change that there we go fifth round uh this is the grand finale grand finale of our gen one celebration our 2021 it's 2021 our 2021 <laughs> Gen 1 celebration that started last January with our, I called it our vanilla, our vanilla playthrough of, of Blue, because we literally just played and we didn't really, we just kind of fucked around. Um, and then we did the randomized red, and now we're going to do a completion run, at least what we can do as far as a completion run without being able to trade or anything like that, um, of yellow as far as completing the Pokédex with every Pokémon that we can physically get in the game. If you got a trade for them, we're not going to be able to get them. I'm not going to use the cheat code engine to get them. We're just not going to worry about them. So, like, the the Gengar, um, Alakazam, Hitmon, or Hitmonchan. Um, not Hitmonchan. Well, you'll only be able to get one of them, unfortunately. Um, Machamp and Golem will be, unfortunately, out of our reach. Yellow's the one with Pikachu. I don't know if you get the other starters in yellow. I don't... I'm, I'm, it's been a long time since I've played yellow. I do have... I do have Cerebi up on my other monitor with, uh, like, the roots so that we can make sure we get all the, all the wild Pokemon in each area to make our life easier. Um, but I haven't really done any research. We're just gonna go section by section, catch all the Pokemans, start evolving our Pokemans... We're going to have a wonderful Pikachu. It's going to be fun. You hit... Oh, you hit 20 followers, Watermelon Guy. Oh, that's that's fantastic. Congratulations, my friend. That's a, that's a huge deal. Hell yeah, you got this. You're going to be at 50 before you know it, my friend. I'm doing fantastic, Miss Yui. How are you doing? 90% better. Just got a lingering cough. Oh, no. Well, I hope I hope that lingering cough passes very quickly and then you're back to 100 percent before you know it you're gonna do to shorten hours at work i'm off till thursday <gasps> oh that's awesome well is that uh, as long as long as as long as you're okay because i know sometimes when they cut your hours that that can cause problems but as long as you're okay and you're enjoying the time off then i'm really happy for you i'm really happy for you uh fridays are also our shorter stream so i'm not gonna I'm not gonna mess around for too long. We're gonna let's jump right over into let's jump right over into the game Pokemon. We haven't done Pokemon in a while. I may. I also want to do this because I want to move the stream loot cards down into the corner. That way they don't. At least in this. And actually, I might move the alerts down into the corner. That way they don't pop up right over the game, and because we have we we have the the room down there on the side. I'm doing fantastic, Miss Yui. I'm ready for for a fun Friday. Uh, I might need to actually reset the game real quick because I forgot I didn't have my controller plugged in when I started up the <clears throat> emulator. So I may need to reset everything. Oh, that's right. This was the first Pokemon on the on the Game Boy Color, so we get we get color. Look at all this color! Look! So let's pass Spotify. So we can enjoy the dulcet tones of, as I click out of the, there we go, the dulcet tones of Pokemon. Look, look at that adorable Pikachu. I guess this is the game where they start moving away from the, the chunky Pikachu and more into the anime style. Let's see if I have to reset. Yeah, hang on. Give me one sec. I should have, uh, I should have set my controller up before, but I didn't think about it. Let me reset real quick. That way our control I'll have controller functionality. You won't hear me click clacking away on the keyboard the whole time. Alright, there we go. Now we should have controller functionality. The DS port of Plants vs. Zombies, but we're almost done with the with with the the PC version of Plants vs. Zombies. 
po Pokemon Pika yellow version. Oh, do we still not have? Oh, we may still not have controller. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh, SpaghettiO. A, A, B, L, R. Uh, I want to select start. Yeah, these buttons don't matter. Now we should have. There we go. Maybe. There we go. <gasps> these Pikas. But what? Why would we? Why would we start another playthrough when we haven't finished the one we've originally started, Watermelon Guy? <laughs> why would I start it again when I still haven't finished it? Oh, look at him! There he is! Look, he's in he's in beautiful color. They did a really nice job. Look at the beautiful color that he's in. <laughs> Oh, is stream loot not working? Oh, let me test the... Let me test the stream loot card. I didn't see anything pop up. Let me test one and see if it's working. We haven't used this scene in over a month now. So let me make sure that everything... I'm not playing that one. Let me make sure that was the, the jump scare one. Uh, let me make sure that everything's working okay. Uh-oh, it may not be. Uh-oh. Stream, what, what you doing? What you doing, Stream Loot? Why is Stream Loot not working? Do I have the wrong... <gasps> oh, that's right, they're turned off. Oh, you know, they turned them off when we did the Beardy Bunch. There we go, now they should be working. Uh, let me see what you played so that I could I could play it again. I'm sorry about that, Endgamer. Oh, the... Actually, here, I'll just give it back to you. I sent it back. Now it should work. That was my bad. I, I forgot we... I turned them off on all scenes when we were doing the, um... The, the Beardy Bunch podcast, because the sounds are still playing, and I couldn't figure out why. Look at these beautiful colors. In, oh, look at look at how colorful Pikachu is. That crisp, crisp yellow. Let's get let's get a chaos pack for Waterman. There, the, there we go. Now it's working. Hell yeah! I'm sorry about that. That was my bad. I for, completely forgot. I turned it off on all scenes. Trying to get the the sounds to stop when we were doing the. The Beardy Bunch podcast recording. There you go, watermelon guy. You got a pack headed your way. Look at that beautiful creature. That beautiful Pikachu. It's beautiful. It's in color. This is the first time we ever saw... This is not the first time we ever saw Pikachu in color. Because the anime was out before this. The, the whole reason this game exists was because of the anime. Oh, what is our name? No, Yellow. No, Jack. No, no, no. no. We're going to be... Uh... Uh, we're gonna be put inspired by whatever that sound alert that Billy has. Your name's Pud. <laughs> Apparently, Pud is something in Australia because Billy has this sound alert that's like, "Trust in Pud, trust in your friends," and I play it all the time over on his stream. And I have no idea what it is. Oh, our rival. Look at how colorful he is. He looks like he's got a little bit of jaundice going on. <laughs> uh, our rival is going to be... Uh... Uh... Sorry, we did butts. Billy was our rival. During our, our Nuzlocke run. And fuck this up. So I think our rival should be our the final rival of the year is our dear father. 
<laughs> That's right. I remember now. His name is Dad. <laughs> Puddin' Dad. <laughs> you played Fortnite today for after four months, so you got 16 kill win in solo, and you're speedrunning Plants vs. Zombies. You stopped the timer, and you're taking a break. Hell yeah. Can you be my rival? Unfortunately, I already made Dad our rival. I'm sorry, Watermelon Guy. I can name a Pokemon after you. Why did you leave us, Dad? Why did you go off to adventure? Oh. Oh. It's very... My room is very blue. What's that song? The, da, the da ba dee da ba da I live in a blue world. <laughs> We're living in a blue world right now. Mom! Everything's blue! Why is everything blue? This is supposed to be Pokemon Yellow. Why is everything blue? Everything's blue! <laughs> the whole world is blue! Oh, uh, we gotta leave. <laughs> They're like, yeah, we've got- we've got all these colors at our disposal now. This is the Game Boy Color. We've got all the colors! <gasps> there he is! Our chunky boy. There, he's not very chunky, though. Oh, oh, Professor Oaks just... Professor Oaks just doesn't care. He's like, yeah, I'm just throwing a Pokeball. I don't care. I'm a living legend. I'm a living legend in the Pokemon world. I don't have to weaken the Pokemon. I just throw a ball and they're mine. Also, there's no Pikachu on Route 1. Where'd that Pikachu come from? On your Switch, you're re-downloading it and play it on a different account and on a different Switch. Uh, a Fortnite? Are you talking about Fortnite? Hell yeah. We got a couple wins in trios last night. Oh, I already- I already have a name. So Pikachu, I already have a name for. And I think everyone knows who Pikachu's gonna be. I hope we have enough- I hope there's enough slots. I already have a name for Pikachu. We're not- we're not gonna read everything, because we've played- we've, we've essentially played this game three times. Or two- technically three times this year, because we did the- the Nuzlocke. Hey! Hey! Those, hey, Dad! Don't just push me out of the way! Peek a peek a bitch! Dad! How dare you just push me out of the way and steal my Pokemon! How dare you just push me? How dare yeah, we're gonna we're gonna tell your grandfather. Professor Oak! Dad pushed me! Dad Dad just came running in and he pushed me out of the way. Oh we got Pikachu, that's fine. We got, we got Pikachu. That's better. That's much better. Uh yeah, we're gonna we're gonna nickname Pikachu. I already know what we're nicknaming Pikachu. We gotta have our boy Bootleg. I don't know if we- I don't think we can do bootleg Pikachu, but we can do bootleg. Uh, just bootleg. <laughs> I was gonna do bootleg Pika, but there's not enough room, so just bootleg. It's our boy bootleg. Bootleg Pikachu in the house. On the party. Yeah, what now, Dad? What now? I got a cool Pikachu. You don't have a cool Pikachu. I do. How do you feel about that, huh? Huh? How do you feel about the fact that everything's blue? It makes me a little uncomfortable. Also, is this trash can here in in red and blue? Oh hell yeah, watermelon guy! I hope you get some wins. Wait, Pud. <laughs> oh, you're on. You're on, Dad. We're gonna take you out. We're gonna take you downtown. You're not even gonna know what hit you. <laughs> they really, they were like, you know, let's let's just throw in. <laughs> Oh, I didn't- I didn't remember that he got Eevee. Oh, that's where Pikachu and Eevee became the thing for Let's Go Pikachu and Eevee. I had no idea that your rival got Eevee in the- in Pokemon Yellow. Oh, we got Thundershot? Yeah, get- get wrecked, Eevee. Get wrecked. oh. Maybe not. Oh! Uh... We get it! <laughs> Oh, 
Yeah, get wrecked. <laughs> throw a water stone at him. <laughs> I mean, they could they could do the same thing to us. They could throw a thunderstone, but Raichu's freaking awesome. I don't think we can evolve our Pikachu. I think it's a thing. I don't I don't think we can evolve our Pikachu in this playthrough. I think we'll have to catch another one to evolve it. <gasps> bootleg grew to level six. This is gonna be a full bootleg Pikachu run. We're gonna have bootleg Pikachu. Like, you know that stream where you all played stream loot cards to keep bootleg Pikachu on stream on on screen for the entirety of a like a six hour stream? You don't have to play cards this time because bootleg Pikachu is in the party. <gasps> is that Zane? The one, the only Zane Wolfware. How are you, my friend? Of Glizzy Island. Well, if if Animal Crossing is anything to show, I'm my island is the chill zone. <laughs> my Pikachu dislikes Pokeballs. You just keep it with you. That should make it happy. We can talk to it and see how it feels about you. Hey, Boulay, Boulay P. Boulay, I'm Boulay Pikachu. I'm not gonna put up with your shit. I'm not putting up with your shit. I'm in charge around here. I'm Bootleg Pikachu. I've been doing fantastic. Thank you so much, Zane. Thank you so much. It's so good to see you. Uh, can we get... Oh, P Pikachu's got... So wait, would Pikachu... Oh, okay. You can walk through them if you push them. I was gonna say, Pikachu has physics, so you can't walk through them. <laughs> Dad is out of Grandpa's lap. <laughs> Dad. <laughs> Dad, why did you leave? Wait, can I not get the map yet? Do I have to go get the the parcel and bring it back? I want, it's a big map. This is super useful. Yeah, give it to me. Yeah, Pikachu, Pikachu is real chonky. Well, this is the first game where Pikachu's not chonky. Oh! Suddenly it's green! <laughs> oh, where that Pidgey? Oh, Pidgey, you're about your your life. Your life is about to end. <laughs> I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry, Pidgey. Oh, it didn't do as much as I thought it was gonna do. A fighting Pokemon only Nuzlocke on Black 2. Ooh, that sounds really cool, Zane. That sounds awesome. That sounds really awesome. Zane, are you planning on getting... Oh, I don't think you have a Switch. I was gonna say, are you planning on getting the Diamond and Pearl remakes in a couple weeks? But I don't think you have a Switch, if I, if I remember correctly. No, you won't die. Fighting types are pretty good. Oh, this Rat oh, oh, <laughs> this shit brown Rattata. <laughs> also, what is the they they tried to? It it sounds like they tried to import. Uh, oh well, <laughs> it sounds like they tried to import audio from the from the anime of Pikachu saying Pika, and I can barely hear it because clearly the Game Boy Color wasn't up to snuff. To play it. Well, we gotta heal. Pikachu, you gotta heal. You gotta heal bootleg Pikachu. There you go. Yeah, get up on the counter. Oh uh, no, this is this is Pokemon Yellow. Pokemon Yellow. <gasps> Caro nine months! Oh, Oh, our stream baby is here! Our stream baby is here! How are you, Caro? It's so good to see you. Also, I gotta jot you down, because that gives you an entry into the giveaway for a signed copy of my book at the end of the month. So let me get you on the list here. And it also helps with the... the... the sub goal to get another book. So initially there's gonna be one book given away. Every 50 subs there's gonna be another book given away. I got you. I got you on the list. You saw a bug type only Nuzlocke. Oh, that sounds like a bad time. <laughs> I don't like bug types. That sounds like a real bad time to me. Come on, bootleg Pikachu. We got shit to do. We have people to see. Why is the guy? Is doesn't the guy? Oh no, he doesn't wait for us. Okay. Yeah, we're from Palatown. Oh yeah. Yeah, I'll be. I'll be your delivery boy. You gonna pay me? You, you gonna pay me for delivering stuff? I'm not. I'm not just free labor, you know. 
Pikachu, how you feeling? Oh, Pikachu. Hey, I'm a uh, bootleg Pikachu here. I'm not doing so good. I got the, I got the twitchy ear thing going on. It's not good. It's not good. I don't think I'm gonna make it. Hood, you better, you better go on without me. I'm not gonna make it. <laughs> oh, it's blue again. <laughs> I like to just imagine that this world has, like, force fields that you go through, and then you pass through that force field, and suddenly the entire world changes colors. <laughs> Can that please be Pokemon Cannon that, in the Kanto region? <laughs> you just pass through, like, I don't even know, like, climate zones. <laughs> Except instead of weather, it's just the whole world changes to a different color. Three days of non-stop- oh, I don't- I'm not a- Oh no, Dad's back, Dad! I can't do shiny hunting. I don't. I don't have the patience for it. Lily's hunting for a, a shiny Sharpedo in Pokemon Shield, or actually, I think Lily has Pokemon Sword. Dad, stop! I want to get my Pokedex so I can start catching them Pokemon. This, what is this, Minecraft? Yeah, this is Pokemon Mod. I think there's a really cool Pokemon Mod for Minecraft. Pixelmon! But I hate to say it, but I don't need you, Dad! <gasps> Dad doesn't need us! Dad doesn't need us! Everybody, ask Dad why... Why he doesn't need us next time we see him? Dad! Why don't- how could- how could you say that? How could you say you don't need us? Well, maybe I'll have to check out Pixelmon at some point. Yeah, now we got the town map. Now we're ready. Now we're rocking and rolling. Alright, so let me- Oh, we gotta get back. We gotta go by. We don't have the Pokeballs yet. I'm pretty sure there's only Rattata and Pidgey on Route 1. I'm almost positive. I know that's the case in red and blue. I don't know if there's anyone else. Hey, bud, move. I don't know if there's anybody else here in yellow. I'm not too familiar with yellow. I played yellow as a kid, but I don't remember a lot about it. Right, we gotta get some Pokeballs. Yeah, give me, give me all your finest Pokeballs. 99, please. Maybe not. Maybe like ten Pokeballs. I had I definitely had yellow as a kid. I think I still have my cartridge of it somewhere. Yellow was real popular, because the anime was popular and everyone really liked Pikachu. Alright, let's see. Route one. Route one Yeah, it's just Oh, here we go. Uh Pidgey and Rattata. 70% chance for Pidgey, 30% chance for Rattata. Completion run, here we come. Let's get us, ourselves a Pidgey and a Rattata. Which is gonna be first? That's Pidgey, there it is. It's already on the screen. My guess, my guess is invalid because the silhouette popped up before I got the words out. Yeah, they tried to do the... Uh, it may die immediately. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Goodbye, Pidgey. <laughs> Good talk. <laughs> Good talk. Good thing this isn't a Nuzlocke. Alright. Well, maybe this one will... Oh, they're both level 2. I Honestly, I might just be able to throw a ball at it. <laughs> it's only level 2. Oh, never mind. Wasted a ball on a level 2 Pidgey. Here's what's gonna happen. The first Pidgey that can survive Thundershock is gonna become our Pidgey. I feel like by the end of it, because you can't take Pikachu off. I don't think you can take... Oh, Rattata. A shit brown Rattata. I don't think you can put Pikachu in the box in this version. So I think you just always have Pikachu, if I'm not mistaken. 
Oh, there we go. We got Rattata. I, I feel like Pikachu is going to be extremely OP by the end of this playthrough. Oh, a Japanese silver cartridge. Ooh, that sounds really cool, Endgamer. We got Rattata. We got Rattata. Do I want to give her... Yeah, we'll give Rattata a nickname. Here, we'll, we'll name... We can't name it Watermelon Guy, because... Too many letters, but we can name it Watermelon. Also, why is it yet bright yellow in its sprite? Here, this playthrough, if I don't if I don't have names via stream loot, I'm gonna name them after people in chat. There you go, Watermelon the Rattata. <laughs> yeah, why why does the sprite for Rattata have yellow? color to it, but Pikachu's doesn't. <laughs> also, look how excited Pikachu is. Like, he's all, it's like, oh, oh, and Pikachu's like, yeah, yeah, pick me, pick me. <laughs> Oops. <laughs> but that's the cool thing about, like, you really don't have to, you really don't have to be able to understand what they're saying in Pokemon to enjoy it. Oh, we gotta get this Pidgey. We gotta get this Pidgey. Here, tackle it, watermelon. Oh, never mind. Never mind. Oh, well. Goodbye. <laughs> Apple. Oh, how many? How many Pidgey do you think we're gonna accidentally <laughs> massacre before we actually weaken one to catch it? Oh, we already got, we already have a Rattata. We already have one, I only need one. No, I can't, oh. Electric moves are super effective against flying. You unlocked a few emotes by doing the two-factor authorization, hell yeah. Oh yeah, those ones. Hell yeah, Zane, that's awesome. <laughs> the answer is yes. All of them. <laughs> All of the Pidgey. There shall be a mountain of small birds. <laughs> oh, this one's level 7. This one may actually survive. Oh, there we go. There we go. This one's level 7. The others were level 2 and 3. I think... I think we... We lucked out. Oh, no, Apple! Are you okay? Is it, is it because of the, the... That's right, Pikachu. Is it because of all the... All the, uh... The, the Pidgey? That that fell in the process of catching this one? Very docile. If attacked, it will often kick up... Sand to protect itself rather than fight back. But it's okay, now we caught one. Um, and you know what, Apple? This is... We're gonna name this Pidgey after you. This one's gonna be named after you. I'm naming, if nobody uses cards to name them, I'm gonna name them after chat. So we've got, with the exception of Pikachu, because we named Pikachu Bootleg. You're welcome, You're, you'll forever live on as, as our Pidgey. That'll more than likely grow into a Pidgeotto and then a Pidgeot. Yeah, get up there, Pikachu. Get up on the counter. Look at Chansey. I never know. Wait, did Chansey look like that? Was oh no, I don't think Chansey was there in Red and Blue. I think this this was like oh Chansey's always in the Poke Center in in the anime. So we've got to put a really a really fucked up looking Chansey in the games. <laughs> I mean this this isn't a Nuzlocke, right? Also. Also, everybody's yellow except for Pikachu. <laughs> Why did they not make Pikachu yellow? Uh, actually, no. Watermelon needs the levels. Because Apple's at level 7, too. Alright, that's everybody on, on Route 1. But I'm going to replace... I think we use three balls. So I'm going to buy three balls. And I know there's at least... Mm, you might be able to get Caterpie and Weedle in yellow. Because I know one of them was exclusive 
I think one of them is exclusive between red and blue, but I think they're both in the Viridian Forest in, in yellow. Oh, that's right, this is the guy. <laughs> so in the Japanese version of this game, this guy's like laying in the middle of the road and he's drunk. Uh, before you, you take the package back to Professor Oak. In, in the, the American translation, they made it that he was just sleeping because he didn't have his coffee. <laughs> oh, what, what are you, what's happening? Are you, oh, you're catching po- Sir, I've already know how to do this. I've already caught all the Pokemon on Route 1. Sir. Zane Wolfware wants you to play blindfolded oh, for five minutes. Okay. Just for you, Zane. Just for you. There you go, Zane. I even got the, the sad face on my blindfold. Alright, sir, I want to go places. Am I going? I'll be able to tell when I bump into something, because it makes it a really obnoxious sound. Well, I'm not. I'm still talking. Okay. Sir, I'm done talking to you. Okay, there we go. It makes the obnoxious noise when you hit a wall. No, wait, are we still... No, I don't... Get away from me. I don't want to talk to you. I don't want to talk to you. I'm going to go to the forest. No, who... Here we go. Music change. We're making progress. I don't know who's on route two. And I can't look right now because I'm blindfolded. So um, we're just gonna wander around here until the five minutes are up and I can check the walkthrough. Maybe we'll find some random encounters though. What was that? What was that noise? Two notches, it's just straight up. It's just right, it's just straight. What am I running into? You just go right up. Do, is it not? It's like a straight line to the Viridian Forest. Oh. Oh. Oh, am I in a building? Oh wait, am I not? Am I still in Viridian City? Did I just go into like the Poke Center? Was that not Route 2? Uh oh. No, this is. This sounds like the music from Route 2. I don't think this is the Viridian. Grass. 
I don't know. I don't know. I'm, I'm sorry, Watermelon. You're probably gonna die. <laughs> I don't know what any of your attacks are. Was that... Was that Watermelon die? Oh! We got Pikachu! There we go! I heard that distorted cry. Oh, okay, so we're... I think we're fighting a Pidgey. That sounded like... That sounded like Gus. Oh, we won! Alright, so we're in grass. We can run around in the grass a little. There we go. <laughs> so I don't know if this there... Is there a timer on this? Oh no, there's no timer! Oh no! I don't know how much time went by! Well, I'll give you like two more minutes. I don't have a timer set up on this scene. That's something I need to fix for next week. I forgot we don't have a timer on, on the Pokemon screen. So let's say it's 51, 52, 52. Xbox, why do you always want to update when I'm I'm streaming? It's probably because I never let you update. <laughs> like ever. Where are the Pokemon at? Uh oh, there is that weird sound again. What is that? Oh, that's the sound of us jumping over a ledge. Oh no. Oh no, we jumped over a ledge. Oh no. Oh, we found some Pokemon. As long as it's Pikachu, we're good, because Thundershock is in the first position. Is that Rattata's cry? Oh, it might be Rattata. I think it's doing Tail Whip. I think that's... Yeah, that's good. I forgot, I don't think I have a... Do I not have a timer period on this one? You started up Animal Crossing today for the first time. Ooh. Ooh, hell yeah. How did that go, Apple? Oh, I do have a timer. I just have it turned off. All right, there, it's on. I'm going to put it... Uh, I don't know. I guess I'll leave it up here. I do have it. I just had it turned off. Now it's turned on. Shoutouts are also turned off on this scene. There we go. Um, oh, okay, we're on route two. This was the ledge we can... Oh, it's not just straight up. There's that ledge there. That's how they get you. That's how they get you. This was probably the ledge we jumped over the first time. Um, I'm pretty sure Watermelon was slain in battle. You got a lot of work to do. Well, that's the cool thing about Animal Crossing, is you can, like, tackle it at your own pace. There's no expectation for you to get everything done at, like, a certain rate of speed. I started building a little outdoor... Um, like cooking area today because I got a an outdoor cooktop with the I think it's new at the update it's one that you could actually cook on did you buy the the DLC Apple to do the island home designs the, the vacation home designs I've been really enjoying that all right, we're going to Route 2. Where's my list for Route 2? Uh, Viridian City and Route 2. Here we go, Route 2. Rattata. Wait, no, this is red. Uh, oh, 
Rattata Pidgey, Nidoran male and Nidoran female. Oh, okay. So Nidoran male and Nidoran female. You also get the, if you upgrade your Nintendo Switch Online subscription, the DLC is free. So if you get the the Online Plus, which comes with the N64 and the Sega Genesis games, um, the Animal Crossing DLC is included in that. We're going to do the old bait and switch and get watermelon some experience. The, even the free update, though, is really sizable. There's a ton of cool stuff in the free update. So even if you don't get the DLC, there's a ton of new stuff to do. There's, honestly, there's almost, with, with that, oh, here we go. With that and the DLC coming out within the first, within a week of one another, within a couple days of one another, it's almost too much new content. Go, bootleg! Growl at me, Nidoran. Why you growl at me? Let's see, let's see if they survive. If they're level 6, they should. Oh. Oh, they're beefy. Beefy Nidoran. Alright, gonna throw. Uh oh. Okay, just grab. We're gonna throw a ball. There we go. Nidoran female was caught. Let's see, who else did we who else do we have in chat that I can name this after? Oh, Caro, Caro the Nidoran. We have Caro the Nidoran. Which will eventually be a Nido Queen. Why are they all why did they they really went on in on the yellow? They're like, we have all these colors! The Game Boy Color can do like oh, three different, four different colors. Uh, it wasn't many. I think it was literally just like red, blue, green, and yellow. It may have just been four base colors. And then they could do like mild shades of them. Mild shade differences. We're like, no, we've got to make every Pokemon yellow because this is the yellow edition. They need to all be yellow. If they're not yellow, we're gonna be real angry. <laughs> Alright, we still get, get Nidoran male before we head into the... into the forest. starters in this game. We may not be able to get Bulbasaur, Charmander, and Squirtle. I don't remember if they're in... Like, is there somebody that gives them to you? I don't remember. I guess we're gonna find out. <gasps> Watermelon, you grew to level 4! And Bootleg grew to level 8! Holy hamburgers! Bootleg learned Thunder Wave? That'll come in handy. Oh, we're just, we're just tearing it up out here. Look at all this progress we're making. No, not a Rattata. What are the percent? 15% for Nidoran male. I can't believe they tried to import an anime audio clip 
onto the Game Boy Color. It sounds so bad. You can barely even hear it over the music. It might not even be coming through on the on the stream because the music is so much louder than it. What are the chant? Oh, Rattata's 40%, that's why. That's it. Yeah, that's mail. Yeah, there we go. Like I said, that's a lot of damage for a level four. There's a crit. Oh, okay. I'm gonna start hucking some balls at it. I think it's Caterpie, Metapod, Weedle. Uh, if Pikachu's here, we should get another Pikachu. Pikachu is not here. Uh, Caterpie and Metapod. Oh, Weedle and Kakuna are not here. So Caterpie, Metapod, and a Pidgeotto. You get Wild Pidgeotto. I'm so happy. <laughs> Neon Medusa. Yes. I love you so much. Neon Medusa, thank you so much for the raid. Welcome on in. <laughs> Raiders, how's everyone doing? We're playing Pokemon. I'm so happy right now. <laughs> Wait, what? I can't hit the games over. Oh no, what? What's happening in this? What's happening in this clip? What was happening? What did? What did you guys do to make Medusa cry? What happened? What? Ha Whoa! Lesser dog! Yeah. Lesser dog, thank you so much for the raid! That's two raids in a row! Welcome on in! Raiders, how's everyone doing? Neon Medusa, I, I want to know who made you cry, Neon Medusa. Who made you cry? I'm going to have a talk with them. Lesser dog! Oh my god, I love that emote. Have I just never seen your emotes before? I love that emote. That emote's amazing. Yeah, double raid. Holy uh, shit. Thank you so much. How are you doing? How How is your stream? And also, how is your stream, Neon Medusa? You were literally, like, not even a minute apart. So I didn't even have a chance to ask how Neon Medusa and everyone's doing. So how is everyone doing? How are both of the raid parties doing? We're playing Pokemon. We're playing Pokemon Yellow. Um, and this is gonna be our Gen 1 completion run where we're gonna we're gonna catch them all like the slogan says And I'm naming Pokemon after after members of chat. So this Caterpie is gonna be named after someone in chat right now If we catch it Here for the old-school Pokemon hell yeah Hotline corazón roto corazón roto corazón roto Oh, have I checked my uh, my my hot pockets? I have. They're in they're in the freezer. Uh, <laughs> although I'm guessing that probably said butthole. It's, Streamlit doesn't like that word. Trust me, dads found out the hard way that they don't like that. 
but I have. I, I check it at least four times a day. It's it's only healthy. <gasps> Hotline! It's it's only healthy that you check at least four times a day. What 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 happened? What happened? What did I do? What did I do? What did I do? I'm sorry. <laughs> I I preemptively apologize for whatever I've done. Oh, oh. Oh, I cut off the rest of the message. Wait, I can go into it though. Wait, what was the rest of the message? But it cut off it cut off butthole. Cause Yeah, well apparently Streamwood doesn't like that. Streamwood has really really strict censoring. I'm really sorry. I, I mean if if you feel like you've been wronged, I could I could send your card back. Like I'll send your card back. But yeah, Streamwood has really has really heavy censoring. So it's they're not they they won't do like butthole or I don't think they'll even do butt. I think someone typed dead once and it censored it. So they they do have fairly strict censoring over on Stream Loop. Oh, there we go. We got a caterpoo. Little caterpoo. Little caterpoo. Who else we metapa and there's also a one. 1% chance of pit. I think we're just gonna we're just gonna evolve our Pidgey unless we get really lucky We're just gonna evolve our Pidgey. I'm not gonna waste my time looking for a 1% chance Pidgeotto Give a nickname. Yeah, we're gonna name this is gonna be Medusa the Caterpie that'll eventually be a uh, a Butterfree so realistically, we don't need anything else here because we can just evolve Caterpie. Yeah, stream loot is really the the censoring is really strict. I'm sorry, Hotline. Sorry, what are you doing here? You're just hanging out in the woods, waiting for people, waiting to jump them. As we're out here collecting Pokemon and trying to have a good time. I don't know why yellow is there. Well, I know it's the yellow version, but. At least Caterpie's the right color. Everyone else are like, no, just make them all yellow. Except Pikachu. Everyone except Pikachu is yellow. Type orange! Welcome on in, Type Orange! I gotta move I gotta move Blurp over to the side so I can see it. Because I have the because I have the walkthrough on the other monitor, I have the game actually over where the game is on the screen. You're getting the DLC. Uh, trust me, I've been having a ton of fun with the DLC. I don't, I don't think you're going wrong by getting the DLC. Uh, oh wait, is Blurp not even on this screen? Okay, so they're not even popping up. The sounds are playing, but they're not popping up on screen, which is weird. All right, I have to work on the the Pokemon scene. We haven't used this in a while. Milkitos, type orange. How you doing, my friend? How did the rest of your stream go? Yeah, Apple's playing Animal Crossing. Look, you're getting everyone back into Animal Crossing, Orange. Nintendo should hire you. They should call you up and give you a job. Because you got me back into Animal Crossing. Well, you and Abby got me back into Animal Crossing. Oh, good chill. Hell yeah. Uh-oh. Mm, chilly, huh? King is Ismail? King Ismail 2002 YT. Welcome on in. Thank you so much for the follow. Here, hang on. Let me get the obnoxious beeping to stop. Thank you for, for popping on in and following. I really appreciate that. How are you, my friend? Are you a, a connoisseur of Pokemon or were you in the in the raid groups? Yeah, get yourself a an Animal Crossing sponsorship. <gasps> you built two more houses! Oh, I did uh I did two more this morning when I was playing when I was hanging out in Kylie's stream I did two more I did some guy that wanted a, a very sports centric house and then there was a there there was a little bear lady that wanted dolls everywhere 
Oh, you're streaming some Pokemon Yellow too? Hell yeah! Hell yeah, how's your run going? I'm planning on catching them all. We're gonna catch them all, and we're, we're as we're catching them all, we're naming them after wonderful folks here in the chat. I think we have everyone in this area. Well, we could get a Metapod, or we could just... We could just evolve... Uh... Medusa. Who's at the lowest level? Oh, Zane, we gotta get you some levels, my friend. He just started 20 minutes ago. Hell yeah! I don't... I don't remember a ton about Pokemon Yellow. So I don't remember exactly some of the differences. I remember playing it as a kid. I still have my old cartridge, but I haven't played it in probably 20 years. Oh, look at that. Look at that jiving skellyman. Look at him over there. Let him go into town. Oh, hi, Mark. <laughs> Is that Bard Owl? Bard Owl. Bar the one, the only, the absolute legendary Bard Owl. I think, I think we've had Watermelon Guy hanging out with us while also live. I don't know if it's as uncommon as it seems. I also think sometimes Mill News pops in while they're live. Oh, thank you, King King is, is Ishmael. Would it be Ishmael? I'm not that good at multitasking. <laughs> to also like to stream, play a game, and bounce around. Caterpoo! The Caterpoo! Let's get, let's get our Caterpoo some levels. Let's do the old, the old bait and switch. To get Medusa some levels. Right now, right now Apple's carrying us. Thank you, Apple. <laughs> Thank you for carrying the team. Oh, you too, my friend. Have a fantastic rest of your stream. Thank you so much for stopping on by, and thank you for the follow. I really appreciate it. A tater pee. <laughs> I'm just picturing, when you say a tater pee, I'm just picturing, instead of a cater pee, it's like a bunch of tater tots. Just, like, strung together, kind of like cater peas in, like, the little sections. Like, caterpillars are in the little sections. Except it's just a bunch of tater tots. Oh, uh, yeah. I don't know who I did. I pick Zane. I think I pick Zane. Let's get Zane some levels. Oh no, I picked Watermelon. I'm sorry. Everybody's at level five. Almost everyone's at level five. It's like level five, and then we've just got the the, the monster trio here. <gasps> Bard Owl, the legendary Bard Owl. How are you? How are you doing? It's always so good to see you. How's your Friday treating you? Horrible! Oh no! Are you okay? Is everything alright? Oh no! I'm really sorry. I'm so sorry to hear it. I hope you're okay. If it's anything that you need to, to vent about, we're here for you. Unless it's like pers something personal that you don't want to talk about, obviously then... Nobody would ever pressure you, but if it's anything that you want to, like, vent about or get off your chest, we're here for you, Bard. We got you. Level 9? Apple, you're at level 9. You're now the highest... I think... I think Apple's the highest level Pokemon on our team. Holy hamburgers. 
Holy hammer, do I have any? I don't. I think we're gonna go back to Pikachu. Get out. Get out of the way. We're going back to town. Type underscore orange underscore wants to name the next Pokemon. Okay. Orange. Oh, or well. Orange, I'm gonna give you I'm gonna give you that card back, my friend, because I'm naming all the Pokemon after members of chat anyway. So you only need to play that card if you want Pokemon named not after chat. So I'm gonna give you that card back. You can hold on to that card for another day, my friend. I'm already naming everybody off 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 the chat members. Unless someone redeems the card to name a Pokemon something else. Because we've already got, with the exception of Pikachu. I named Pikachu Bootleg. We needed our Bootleg Pikachu. We've got Zane the Nidoran, Apple the Pidgey, Caro also the Nidoran, but just male and female Nidoran. Uh, we got Watermelon the Rattata, and we got Medusa the Caterpie. Oh, we'll be here. We'll be here, Endgamer. Thank you so much. Oh, no, wait. Oh, Bard out. I'm sorry. I saw Endgamer say see you in a bit. No worries, Bart out. We will be here. You got nothing to worry about. Let me get the mouse pointer off the screen. That's obnoxious. We'll be here. I hope everything's okay. But yeah, I sent that card right on back to you, Orange, because we're we're already we're already naming Pokemon after chat. This is gonna be the dream team. This is our completion run. So this is gonna be the dream team. And you can tell because we've got bootleg Pikachu. We haven't checked in on Bootleg Pikachu to see how they're doing in a while. We'll check in on them in a hot sec here. We'll see how they're doing. Ooh, some leftovers. Ooh. What did you what did you have in here? Anything good? Oh, Bootleg Pikachu's happy. He's like, hey, I'm, uh, I'm having a good time. I'm really I'm vibing. And I'm, uh, you know, living my best life. And we're going into the forest. Usually the forest has some of my, some of my brethren hanging out but apparently in pokemon yellow there's no pikachu in the forest so uh so that's kind of sad but um i'm still happy i'm still happy all the same because i'm a freaking pikachu some cold pizza and bread <gasps> Ooh, that sounds really good in gamer cold pizza is sometimes where it's at i haven't i haven't eaten like cold leftover pizza in a while but i i remember the days oh, i did not mean to walk into the grass Gustus just a normal move. I keep thinking Gustus flying. Oh, well, doesn't matter. <laughs> yeah, Boo like Pikachu just <laughs> just completely completely caused the extension the extinction, not the extension, the extinction. Of all Pikachus in the Viridian Forest, just so we wouldn't notice that it wasn't the real Pikachu. Your head off to bed. No worries, Lesser Dog. You have a fantastic evening. I hope you get a great night's sleep. Thank you so much again for that raid. I hope you have the best night's sleep possible. Oh, six Pidgey. We don't need a Pidgey, we already have a level 9 Pidgey. G-Wolf, how are you, my friend? Oh, look at that. Look at that orange emote. I love those orange emotes. They're freaking adorable. Look at them. But they're, they've got, like, the big anime eyes. I think the eyes are my favorite. You did a really nice job on the eyes with your emotes, Orange. They got those big anime eyes. Oh, Pikachu's gonna be really bad against... I didn't think about that. Pikachu's gonna be horrible in a fight against Brock. I'm doing fantastic. Thank you so much. They were ugly glasses originally. Well, you, you, you made it work. They look fantastic. Luckily, we've got Apple, Apple the, the Pidgey, to carry us through. And the heart. The heart's pretty amazing. They're all pretty amazing. 
I, I am quite partial to Cube Mario, though. I think Cube Mario is where it's at. Although I don't know... Well, it, Gust is normal, so Gust should be okay. We're still going to be at... At the rate we're going, we're going to be really low level. But luckily, this isn't a Nuzlocke, so it doesn't matter. We can... We can just grind our way through the trainers in there. And not have to be scared. Hell yeah, it's a fantastic card emote. Metapod! Also, our trainer's name is Pud. Uh, let's get... Let's get Medusa some levels. Because a, uh... A Metapod or a Butterfree could actually be potentially really useful. Against Brock. Apple, Apple the Pidgey does feel pretty perfect. Usually crew to level six. Hell yeah. They really went heavy on the, on the yellow for all the sprites. <laughs> like, nah, this is Pokemon yellow. It's gotta be 90% yellow. Oh we, oh, we did run into a Metapod. Uh, uh, I'm gonna, we're, we're gonna hold on to, we're gonna hold on to Medusa. Because... Caterpie is already at a higher level than this Metapod. Maybe not. Yeah, it's always right around this time. I'm pretty sure that the, the boost is on a timer. I'm pretty sure it pops up at specific intervals, because it, it almost always pops up around this time. Zane grew to level 7. Alright, Zane should just be able to fight there. In fact, we might want to throw someone else in the first slot. Yep, tonight's all Pokemon. Friday's always my short stream. So tonight will just be Pokemon. They only go until midnight Eastern time on Fridays. It used to be because of the uh, we used to record the beer, the Beauty Bunch podcast on Fridays, and I've just kind of kept it as my my short evening instead of going until two or three in the morning. Oh, I didn't want to use Leer. I never want to use Leer. <laughs> There's never an instance where I'm like, hmm, maybe I should use Leer. But we'll be back tomorrow. We'll be back playing some Diablo 2 with Lily tomorrow. Um, hopefully we'll be able to finish the the third act of Diablo 2. Because I think we're more than halfway through the, the third act. Let's switch in... Uh, I th think having a high level either Metapod or Butterfree will actually be super useful against Brock. Tackle fight! Me too. I'm so excited for the, the remakes to come out in a couple weeks. Oh, you just look up and hit A. 
Uh, but you can't be holding anything, so if you're holding anything in your hand, Apple, um, you gotta put away anything you're holding. I was making that mistake the one day. If you got, like, a shovel in your hand or anything like that, you gotta, you gotta put it away first. I was doing that the one night. I had something. I was probably running around with my shovel or something. And I kept looking up and I was like, why isn't it working? I just want to get the stars so I can make cool stuff. <gasps> Neon Medusa! Thank you so much for those five! Count them five, Corgo biddies! Oh, no worries, Medusa. You have a fantastic evening. I hope you have a great le rest of your night. I hope you have a great weekend if I don't get to talk to you over the weekend. I hope everything's absolutely fantastic on your end. Thank you so much again for the raid. Oh, we may want to we may want to switch. We we can't we can't have Medusa the Caterpie fall in battle while we're while we're wishing IRL Medusa, a good night. We gotta switch, we gotta send him to Lake Pikachu. <laughs> that would have been some bad juju. Oh, there's an item over here. What we got here? Put found a potion. That's good. I'm about to leave the, the forest though. So, I mean, oh, we're gonna have to fight this guy. Actually, I think there are there two trainers before we get out. I think I've decided I'm Type get... underscore orange underscore doesn't think oh. you need to heal in the next trainer battle. Oh, don't worry. They believe I, in you. I probably wasn't going to anyway. <laughs> the funny thing is that card was added like around the time we were doing the Nuzlocke. I almost never use potions when I'm not worried about actual like actually losing Pokemon. <laughs> Unless I'm concerned that, like, I'm gonna have to- Oh, holy crap, level 10! Oh! Oh! This might actually be bad! Uh-oh! Uh-oh! <laughs> it's so much easier to just have your team be really OP. Except in instances like this, but we do have a Pikachu. We definitely shouldn't have a Pikachu, and I think... I think the Pikachu in yellow automatically has really good IVs. Nah, we got this. We don't need this any stinking healing items. We got this Caterpie's going down. Look, there it goes. It's gone. It's out of here. Get out of my house. Get out of my house, Caterpie. That's it. He only had one Caterpie. out of my house. Oh no, I guess just one. I don't know why I thought there was a second battle there. Uh, is anyone new here? They've really switched up some of the the random encounters in yellow. Uh, well, I think this is also route two? They're both route two? Oh. Well, there's a trade for Mr. Mime somewhere. You need a Clefairy. I think that's on the other side of route too. I think that's when you come up from the the Diglett cave though. Okay, so there's nothing new here. This is apparently still route two. Okay. Oh Pewter Oh, Pewter City <laughs> Pewter City just gave up on colors. It's like nah. <laughs> oh it's very blue. It is a different shade of blue though. Either it's a different shade of blue. Or it looks like a different shade of blue because they intermixed some gray in. Oh, G Wolf, you have a fantastic evening, my friend. I hope you had a great night's sleep. Thank you so much for stopping by. I really appreciate you. Alright, uh. Gym! To the gym! 
probably gonna lose. Spoiler. We're, uh, we're definitely not high enough level for the gym. Because I think, I think Brock's gonna have, like, a level... 16. I think Onyx is gonna be level 16. And our Storm just is still level 8. So this is uh, potentially going to end poorly. <gasps> Dangle it! Oh, oh, that's not that's not good. They were like, "Yeah, we're gonna we're giving you this Pikachu to start, and then we're gonna hit you with a Diglett at the first gym." That's cruel. That's cruel and unusual. But luckily, we've got Apple. So I don't think Diglett Diglett probably only has Scratch. Yeah, Scratch and maybe Growl. I need some someone tell me how is this how is this little how is this little ground hot dog scratching us where where are the where are the nails required to do the scratching uh oh there's a bug that Nintendo posted about Animal Crossing on Twitter uh oh what's what's the bug did they say what the bug is or are they keeping it hush hush This is not good. I'm really hitting us with the ground types. I don't think... I don't think there's usually this many ground types. <gasps> Sleepy! How you doing? Welcome on in... Uh-oh. Welcome on in, Sleepy. Hell yeah! How you doing? How's your Friday treating you? Ooh. This is going poorly. I'm surprised they even let you design. That's well. That's probably what they'll end up patching in is for it to not let you design if your if your gates open. Because I know um, Captain won't let you travel if your gates open. No Apple. No Pikachu's gonna be useless. Uh, maybe we Pikachu can weaken it though. Pikachu's only got Thundershock, which is going to be... Don't worry, Apple. We'll bring you back. We'll bring you back better than ever. We'll bring you back better than ever. I promise. We're going to lower its defense. We're going to sacrifice Bootleg Pikachu to lower its defense. This is definitely- I don't remember anyone having a Diglett and a Sandshrew in, in the red and blue runs. They intentionally- they did this on purpose. They're like, nah, we're giving them- we're giving them a Pikachu. Oh no! No! I never want to use a Leer! <laughs> I mean, it did lower the defense, but- No! <laughs> there we go, that's what we're talking about. Oh no. Oh no, they're faster. They're faster than us. Can can Medusa bring it home? I think so. They should do it. Yeah, it's defensive really low. But do they have anything else? I don't know. Oh, Carl grew to level 7. Okay, cool. That was real close. <laughs> <laughs> Medusa's evolving! <gasps> I'm really glad we didn't, I didn't stop to catch that Metapod, because we immediately have a better Metapod. That was only at level 4. A free stream loot pack? Hell yeah! Let me get a pack, Type Orange. Let me send a pack on over your way.
There you go. You got it. Oh, Medusa learned Harden. All right, run away to the Pokey Center. Run away. <laughs> This would, if this were a Nuzlocke run, that would have been really bad. Oh no, someone's calling me on Discord. <gasps> oh no, don't they know that we're playing Pokemon? Don't they know that we've gotta we've, we've gotta train our Pokemon? That's that's way more important. We got we gotta have the best Pokemon so we can be the very best, like no one ever was. There, it's okay. Apple's back. Apple's back and fighting and fighting fit. So is everybody else that fell in battle, including Bootleg Pikachu. Hey, Bootleg Pikachu, how you feeling? Oh, Bootleg Pikachu is like, hey, uh, I know, uh, I, I know you know how to play these games. I know you know that you need to, you know, grind for levels and shit because it's a JRPG. Oh, we're just, I guess we're just going back. Oh, oh, okay. <laughs> oh, okay. You sure about this? Hey, uh, I don't. I got a bad. I got a real bad feeling that we should do this. No, no, no. Don't, don't worry. Boy, Pikachu, don't worry. Don't worry. We got this. <laughs> we got this. So don't, don't worry about anything, Boy, Pikachu. I'm sure. What's the worst that could happen? I'm sure nothing terrible. Type happen. underscore orange underscore wants you to walk to your death. I mean, I think that's gonna happen anyway. <laughs> I suspect that's gonna happen anyway. <laughs> <laughs> uh, the only thing I have to think to do is just use... Here, we'll just use Harden. <laughs> not stop Harden. That, that's the only real way to, to just walk to your death is not use any attack moves. <laughs> the funny thing is, it's gonna be a really slow process. Because <laughs> I'm gonna keep raising my defense. You're getting your money's worth, Orange. You're, you're getting you're getting a real show out of this one. Yeah, but then you wouldn't have gotten your money's worth. I want to make sure you get your money's worth. You get to watch that health bar slowly drop. Oh, look at look at how slowly it's dropping, just little by little by little by little. <laughs> <laughs> Where'd it go? Oh, there it is. All right, there's, there's, there's your death. <laughs> uh, <laughs> Apple, <laughs> I believe in you. <laughs> I'm the only one that can do it. Oh no. Uh, uh oh. Um, hmm. Hmm. Uh oh. Uh oh. <laughs> uh oh. <laughs> Ro. We may uh we may have to go grind. Oh, Bully Pikachu, I believe in you. I know that you're gonna be at a type disadvantage, but uh I believe Wait, does it I know, I know electric isn't very effective, but I didn't think it was completely negated by rock types. Am I wrong? I know it's ne negated by ground types, but I didn't think rock types negated electric moves. I just thought they weren't effective. Yeah, well, is Geodude rock ground? Oh, maybe Geodude's rock ground. Ah, that's why, okay. Uh, well, we're in trouble. <laughs> we're in, uh, we're in big trouble. <laughs> uh, <laughs> Geodude's just punching us in the face. <laughs> oh, well. Oh, God. <laughs> hmm. Maybe what I don't think I'm gonna say we're not gonna win this battle. Oh, we got him in the yellow. There's still he still has Onyx though. I think it's Onyx. They could have given him someone else in this in this playthrough. 
but I think it's still on it. Oh, uh, Carl. <laughs> I'm so sorry. Uh, oh, Watermelon's the, the weakest of our team. But, uh, you know what? I think I think they can pull it off. Here we go. Oh, they're doing more, they're doing more damage than... <laughs> oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. <laughs> Everything's terrible. Zane, I believe in you. I believe in you, Zane. Uh, we're gonna have to go grind for some levels. <laughs> I really like Geodude's sprite in this one. I I think that this must have been the game where they really started to figure out what the Pokemon, what the Gen 1 Pokemon looked like. Because they, Geodude did not look this much like Geodude in red and blue. Oh, well. Puts out a Pokemon. Pud went back to the Poke Center. Also, we haven't saved it all. Maybe we should do that. Just just in case. <laughs> well, we gotta go get some levels. Come on, bootleg Pikachu. Type underscore orange underscore doesn't think oh. you need to heal for the next five minutes. <laughs> Good thing I wasn't gonna. <laughs> I wasn't gonna heal. We're gonna we're gonna tackle. We're just gonna like. I imagine we're just like because Metapod doesn't really move. We do we have to like pick him up and like throw him at Rattata, get him to attack. <laughs> I mean, if I die, it's gonna automatically heal me. I won't have any control over that. <laughs> that I won't have any power. I don't. I don't think we're going to though. Metapod's got fairly high defense. Metapod's who I want to get up. I want to get Metapod to like level twelve-ish, twelve-ish, which I think will be. I believe Metapod evolves to Butterfree at twelve. <gasps> Medusa grew to level eight. But yeah, Metapod's real beefy with defense. That's what makes what um, makes Butterfree really good. Need a ram. Need a need a ram. Tackle. Yeah, and I bet if we had caught that wild Metapod, it would not have known tackle. I think the wild Metapods only have String Shot and Harden. So I'm really glad that we, we leveled up Caterpie instead of catching the, the wild Metapod that we ran into. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, Spaghetti! The timer's still not working? Where is the timer? Oh, I know it. It's under... I think it's under the... No, it's not under the background. Where is the timer? That's weird. Hmm. Hmm. You're timing it? Hell yeah. I don't know what's going on with the timer on this on this scene. I have to... I'm going to have to troubleshoot this scene because we haven't used this one in a while. We haven't used this one since before Spooktober. So maybe some of the... Maybe some of the alert links are not are not working correctly. Level tree Rattata. Level tree. Yeah, the URL URL might have changed. I might have even changed the URL for all I know. Because I definitely updated a lot of stuff when I was making the Spooktober deck. So that we can we can become beefier. Just slowly beating them down. Just out here minding their own business. We come along with our iron cocoon. No. 
poor Rattata. Had a whole a whole family and a whole life ahead of it. And then we just came out here and we cut it down in its prime. <laughs> okay, we're gonna we're gonna start baiting and switching. Uh I think Pikachu's useless to us right now. You're useless, bootleg Pikachu. You're useless. This is a real hard mode. I know everyone always says that uh, Charmander is is hard mode for red and blue, but this is the real hard mode. They even threw those ground types at you right there in the first gym. But this is gonna get really easy later on. That's the difference. Misty, Misty is gonna be a joke compared to our, our beefy bootleg Pikachu by the time we get there. Oh, look at that. Look at that power. Look at that power. Power in that little Pidgey. Get him! Get him! Don't give him a chance to get up! Get him! for Apple. The death sound is so annoying. <laughs> it's so freaking annoying. Especially when it just plays on repeat like that. Five minutes. Okay, we're gonna go. We're gonna run to the the Poke Center. And we're gonna heal up our little Metapod. That way we can just start fighting things. We can just start fighting things. Cause it's grind time. I don't think. Can we go? Can we go to Mount Moon before we beat Brock? I don't think so. I think there's a guy blocking the path. Yeah, get up there on the counter, boot like Pikachu. Yeah, get in that computer. Get in there. <laughs> that is the derpiest chance. Look at that chancy. What's the why is Jigglypuff here? <laughs> beautiful. Listen to that beautiful Jigglypuff song. Hey Pikachu, how you feeling? Hey, uh, it's Boo Lake Pikachu here. You know, I uh, I warned you. I said we weren't ready. To, we weren't ready to fight Brock, but you uh, you just ignored me. Why Why'd you do that? Why'd you just ignore me? Yeah, this guy's gonna stop. Oh, this? No, 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 sir, <laughs> sir, <laughs> sir. Listen, listen, <laughs> listen. Listen, I've been there. I've been there already. I've already been here. Where are you going? You can't go that way. There's a, where did he go? There's a wall here. Did he phase through that wall? Did he climb over it? Where did he go? Can we go past now? Because I know there's higher level Pokemon that we can grind. Oh, no, sir. No, no, no. Stop. Don't do this again. No. No! <laughs> no, stop! Stop! Why you do this? Oh, yeah, yeah, just, yeah, 
This is, this is the play, yeah. What if I'm just like, maybe I'm not a trainer. Where does he go? Maybe I'm not a trainer. Maybe I'm like, I'm just on an adventure. I'm just trying to find myself out here in the Type world. underscore orange underscore says hands up for five seconds. Oh, that timer worked. Well, maybe it's the Pokemon one. Or the healing one. That'll work. I'm confused. I'm very confused. I'm very confused. I wish we could go that other way. Did I ever go here? I did. Because we talk, we, we listened to Jigglypuff sing to us. It's a beautiful rendition. Jigglypuff's patented song. Um, Jiggly Mania. That's what it's called. Jiggly Mania. Don't ask what it's about. I can't. I can't talk about it on Twitch. I'm not allowed. It's too explicit. R-rated Jigglypuff song. Rattata. I'm gonna say that Rattata doesn't look like he could scream it anymore. In, uh, in red and blue, Rattata just straight up looked like it was screaming all the time. What, wait, what did you type that got censored type orange? <laughs> or did you censor yourself? <laughs> Level 9! Level 9 hard boy! The gust coming in. It's so dumb that gust is is a, is a normal type move and not a flying type move. Oh my God. You gotta take out Pidgey. You got this. You got this, Medusa. Hold, hold down, hold down the fort. Hold down the fort. <gasps> There's a hit on top in chat. Holy hamburgers. Yeah, get that Hitmontop. Hitmontop's really cool. Although I imagine Hitmontop has... probably gets sick to its stomach a lot. Imagine just spinning around on your head all the day. And that's just your... Well, Hitmontop does have legs, so I guess that wouldn't be their primary means of transport. But still, just imagine spinning around on your head. I'd get, I'd get nauseous. I'm getting nauseous just thinking about it. <laughs> Not really, but... <laughs> oh, come on, we gotta get... We gotta get those levels. Okay, well, we'll speed grind. Speed grinding. <laughs> speed grinding! <laughs> Oh no! Oh no, speak right we lost! We lost Medusa! Wait a minute, Pikachu's freaking out! Pikachu's freaking out! I don't even know what happened. <laughs> oh no, Orange, I'm so sorry. Hitmontop escaped. It escaped back into the wilds. <laughs> oh no, Orange, I'm so sorry. But you know what? It's it's Hitmontop's loss. Okay, here we go. Speed grind. Grind. This definitely makes grinding a lot faster. 
<laughs> did it! <laughs> the sound of it's really annoying, though. Oh, no, Medusa went down again. No! fucking thing. Sub. Oh, we gotta get you on the list for the giveaway. Let's get you on the list for the giveaway. You're entered for a chance to win an autographed copy of one of my books at the end of the month. That also puts us up to 34 subs toward the 50 needed to get a plus one to the giveaway, which is another book given away. Which will mean we'll give away two books at the end of the month instead of just one. How you doing, Flannel? Bear with me while we speed grind. Why do we keep missing? Why do we keep missing? Stop missing! There we go. <gasps> Medusa grew to level 10! <gasps> Medu- oh! Oh, I thought Metapod evolved at level 12. Bird up! <laughs> Bird up! Oh! Oh, it, it starkly changed the blue! <laughs> Can, ooh, that'll actually probably come in handy. I am speed. Let's see, confusion. Oh! I just like when Pikachu's are. It's like, oh god! Oh god, what's happening? What's happening to me? Being fluffy, you oh, I love that one. Rainbow. I love that one. ka -chow. I love that walk-on. It's so perfect. So I still want to get, I want to get Butterfree to 12, so we don't get our ass handed to us again. Although I think Confusion's gonna really help. Confusion's really OP for the beginning of the game. Look at this, we're just one hit KOing everything now. Wants a top, a top secret, secret cozy recipe. Oh, I've got I've got a good one for you. I've got a, a real good one for you this time. It's 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 a very special breakfast glizzy. You know I've done I've did a breakfast glizzy before, but I want to make an amendment because originally the breakfast glizzy that I designed had the maple syrup kind of drizzled on the top of it with little bacon bits. Oh, that was the refund. Oh, I forgot about that. I could not think of anything. That was like the peak of I'm losing my mind. I've been awake for 23 hours. But the new and improved breakfast glizzy doesn't just have syrup drizzled on the top. You inject the syrup directly into the glizzy so that every bite, every bite is, is a, a lot of syrupy goodness while it also has bacon on the top. And uh, personally, I'd put some eggs on the top, like some uh, some runny eggs. Just drizzle them on the top of the glizzy. That sounds fantastic to me. But I know that's not everybody's cup of tea. I know they make they make burgers like that where they just put the eggs on there <laughs> with the ketchup. I don't remember what it was. 
<laughs> yeah, you put ketchup on there, you know. It's top secret. A secret recipe. No, what you do is you inject that maple syrup into the glizzy, and you, just, you absolutely destroy it with bacon bits on top. And possibly eggs, if you're okay with that. I'd like eggs on a glizzy. Let's see, let, let, let's see what we can do. Let's go fight. Let's go fight Brock. What do you think, Bootleg Pikachu? You think we can win? Hey, um, I'm Bootleg Pikachu. I think this is, a, this is a bad idea. You should stick to your original play. You should get... Look, you got, you've got speed on your side. You should just get... Just get... Just get Medusa up to level 12. No! No, Bootleg Pikachu. We've got this. Type Orange believes in us. <laughs> Type Orange believes in us. We can do it. We can do it. Bootleg Pat. Well, we're not going to use Bootleg Pikachu at all because Bootleg Pikachu is useless to us in this fight. Bootleg Pikachu is useless. We're going to use Medusa. Then we're going to use Confusion. Oh, that's much better. Sound like a formal vest. I love that. That sounds fantastic. That sounds absolutely fantastic. I love me some bacon. There we go. This is going considerably better already. <gasps> Medusa's at level 11. Oh, we're already off to a fantastic start. Onyx. Are we going to change? Probably. I would not advise it. Oh. Oh. They clearly did not have. They figured out some of the Pokemon sprites by, by yellow. Onyx is not one of them. <laughs> Onyx just looks like he has his nose like, oh, oh, look at this. Look at this Butterfree. This Butterfree thinks it's gonna be able to use confusion for the whole fight and just win. Oh. <laughs> it was like a fit. It kind of does look like a fit. Well, oh, this went really well. Oh, look at this. Med Medusa carried us through. Pud defeated Brock. See, Blue Light Pikachu, I told you, we we channeled we channeled Orange's belief, and we were able to do it. We were able to pull off a flawless victory after we were utterly destroyed the last time. Yeah, what do you think about that, Brock? Oh, you're gonna give us TM34. Contained top Pokemon. It's was it's Bide, I think. Is it Bide? Yeah, Bide. Get out of here with freaking Bide. Oh, I used to love the orange. I loved that season. The Orange League episodes were really solid. You should have been in the league. I bet you would have been really successful. We need more. How many, how many balls do I have? I've got six balls. Give me four balls, sir. Also, probably... Probably an escape rope. They named a whole season of Pokemon after you, Orange. How does that make you feel? <laughs> nah, nah, nah. I don't need. I don't need to see a doctor for my four balls. <laughs> <laughs> oh hell yeah, you do, Orange. Pokemon's fantastic. I'm really excited for when when Di the Diamond and Pearl remakes come out because I know everyone's gonna be playing them. And what's gonna be like we're playing Pokemon together, even if we're not like physically playing together, we're all gonna be playing. It's gonna be such a good time. I've I've decided I'm getting Diamond. Brilliant Diamond. Cause Pearl is dumb. I don't like the like even back when Pearl came out, I was like, that's a dumb name. It was like, alright, gold, silver, red, blue, gold, silver, um, emerald, or not emerald, um, Sapphire and Ruby and Sapphire, and then it's like Diamond and Pearl. Pearl is dumb. <laughs> it's just dumb. The original Diamond was the first Pokemon game, let alone video game you bought with your own money. Oh, hell yeah, Flannel. I never played Diamond and Pearl until way, way, way after. I've still not played uh, Ruby and Sapphire either. But I played Diamond and Pearl way after. I fell off of Pokemon after Gold and Silver. And 
I eventually, okay, Pewter City and Route 3. Let's see what's on Route 3. Yeah, Pearl is not, like, I don't even see, because it was always, like, these are stark opposites or, like, contrasting things, like, gold and silver, or, like, contrasting elements. I don't see diamond and pearls as being anywhere in, like, the same, like, yeah, they're both, like, jewels, but they're not that, that similar. Oh, I'd love the sign. If you have the science, I'd love it. Maybe they put more thought into it than I realized. But yeah, I didn't, I didn't play Diamond and Pearl until way after. I fell off after Gold and Silver, because then I was going into high school. Maybe middle school. And Yu-Gi-Oh! was taking over. So I fell off of Pokemon until Black and White. And then I went back and I played Diamond and Pearl. And Heart Gold and Soul Silver. Which are fantastic. When you boil it down, diamonds are made by earth-based pressure, and pearls are made from water? Oh, shit. I didn't know that. Okay. Alright, I take everything I just said back. <laughs> I take everything I just said back. <laughs> Strike it from the VOD. <laughs> I had no idea. I knew about diamonds. I knew that diamonds were, were caused from earth-based pressure. I didn't know that that's what pearls were for. Well, I guess, yeah, pearls are found in Bird water. Up. Bird up. Uh, let's get, let's get Apple. Let's get Apple some levels. Well, they've added a lot of stuff to this route. And taken a lot of stuff away. There's, there's a Sandshrew and a Mankey in this route now. Is this? Yeah, oh, there's a Sandshrew and a Mankey on this route. There was... I think San Sandra was on this route. I don't think Mankey was. But I think Jigglypuff was. It's Platinum that's the odd one out. Oh. Well, I've, I always thought Crystal was, was kind of strange, too. I think Platinum would have made more sense as the third game for Gold and Silver. If they did Gold, Silver, and Platinum, that would have made more sense instead of Crystal. And Crystal probably would have made more sense for Diamond and Pearl as the third version. Apple Griddle level 11! I'm not... I'm not mean! I'm really nice! I promise, I'm nice! Uh, we gotta get to the grass so we can catch more Pokemans. We can catch the Pokemans. Or Topaz, because like one of Giratina's Dominic Cut, that is true. I only played Platinum. I didn't play so I, I said I, I didn't I went back and played Diamond and Pearl. Correction, I played Platinum. I played the third version. Pokemon Fridays! Jinto, thank you so much for those five biddies! Five celebration biddies! How are you, my friend? Welcome on in. Welcome on in. How's your Friday treating you, my friend? It's always so good to see you. Oh, Jinto's following you. Well, I mean, there's there's worse stalkers to have, well. If I if I had to pick a stalker, I I think Jinto would be in my top three. Yes, we gotta we gotta get Medusa is great, but we need we need levels for everybody else. <laughs> we need to start leveling everyone up because we need to start evolving. Tropius, ooh, Tropius is really cool. Topaz, Pokemon Topaz would be a really cool name for a Pokemon game. <laughs> Something, yeah, just just clip that and. <laughs> Download it to like your your virtual your virtual resume. <laughs> Jinto gets two two thumbs up of approval for being in my top three potential stalkers. <laughs> I 
<laughs> Two glizzies up. <laughs> I don't know if you if you show them that they get two two, two glizzies up, they might think that's something else. I don't I don't know if, if you want that smoke, <laughs> sir. Oh yeah, the the corgo the corgo is back as our first follower emote. I brought back the corgo. The corgo was gone for a while. Sir. Also, if anyone has any ideas for anything else they would like as follower emotes, let me know, because we have a bunch of follower emotes now. You didn't you didn't get approved for the emote beta. So I think the criteria to get into the beta is I think you need instant approval on your emotes. Do you, do you have instant approval? Like when you upload e new emotes, do they have to get manually approved or do you get instantly approved? From what I understand, that was the criteria, is you need instant approval to get into the beta. That mm, might be it. I, I mean, I don't know. I don't know. Maybe it's just like a... Maybe it's just coming. Because I know some folks had it, had it before. Like, um... We had one of our Australian friends, uh, Hamie Jamilton, has had it for a couple months now. I know Orange and I just got the email, like a week, was it like a week ago, Orange? I know we, you mentioned it the same day I got the email. But honestly, I don't, I don't know how I feel about, I don't want to put a ton of resources into the follower remotes because A, they can only be used here. You can't use them on other channels. And B, they don't work if you're on mobile. Or unless they fixed it. But over on Orange's channel, um, his follower emotes don't even show up in the list of emotes for me if I'm on the on the mobile app. So I don't wanna I don't wanna put in a ton of effort or like have Lily put in a ton of effort making emotes for follower emotes if Barely anyone's gonna get to use them. I'd rather wait and like make a nice Christmas me emote or something for uh, for the just for the main channel or for the like the regular emotes. Maybe I'll maybe I'll move Sir to a follower emote. Although I like I like spamming Sir. <laughs> we will make. Different variations of the Sir emote in different colors, and those will be our follower emotes. <laughs> oh no! Apple! No! 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 Oh no, Jinta, what happened with the at everyone by posting into the wrong Discord? Uh oh. Bird down! Apple, no! Okay, we got bootleg. Uh oh. Bootleg Pikachu, bootleg Pikachu does almost nothing. <laughs> yeah, at least if you're if you were a subscribe like subscribe to the channel, then let them use the follower emotes everywhere. They're on the site, so clearly like they have them in the database if they could show up. Don't worry, Apple. We're gonna heal you. We're gonna make you better than ever before. Youngster. Please stop, stop beating up my friends. Now we gotta go, we gotta run back here. And we gotta transition the world in, into black and white. I hate when that happens. I hate when I'm just walking through a mount, mountain pass and everything turns black and white suddenly. I hate when that happens. Oh, Chaos Pack, hell yeah. Let's get a Chaos Pack while we're healing up. Uh, chaos Pack for flannel. Flannel. Chaos Pack, headed your way. Alright, so we got Spiro, Sandshrew, and Mankey on Route 3 that we have to catch. Well, Spiro's going to be easy, 55% chance. Sandshrew and Mankey are only 15% chance. Stream 
some packs for all. <gasps> yes, let's get a link for everyone to get some stream loot. Some stream loot injected directly, directly into their diet. And by their diet, I mean um, their stream loot inventory. Mike, anytime from 11 to 11 tomorrow, you should peek in for spookiness. She'll be handing out Dixper codes. Ooh, oh, are you doing Are you doing a 12-hour stream tomorrow, Gento? Oh, hell yeah. I think Ratzel's doing a 12-hour stream tomorrow, too. That's going to be exciting. I'm going to have quite a few streams to check out. I should be able to pop in in the, in the afternoon. Because I'll probably, knowing me... Uh, I'll sleep in until the afternoon. Everybody, click that link. Get yourself some stream loot. But I'll definitely be there. You better believe I'll be there. What uh, What's on the agenda for the stream? Don't hurt anymore. Oh, don't hurt my Pokemon. You into your Halloween one the same week as a bunch of as a bunch of other friends. Little night. Oh, little nightmares too. Outlet. Oh. Poppy's Playtime. I want to play. I bought that. I want to play that myself. That was one of the games I had potentially for Spooktober. Because I heard I heard really good things about that one. So I'll be very curious to, to, to see how your playthrough goes. I haven't seen anything of it yet. That's the order you'll be playing in. Oh, hell yeah. Outlast is really good. Outlast is really solid. I definitely want to try and stop in and see you play some Outlast. Although Little Nightmares 2 is also fantastic. I, um, have you played Little Nightmares 1, the first one, Jinto? Did Blue Eye Pikachu make an appearance just for a minute? Uh, sure. Sure. I'm, I'm concerned why. Oh, I feel like there's about to be banjo music. I'm predicting it now. Banjo music incoming! Wonderful banjo music composed by... The also wonderful type orange. There it is. Not only do we have ban bootleg Pikachu, banjo, banjo Pikachu. This is we've changed, we've rebranded. This is banjo Pikachu. Uh, not only do we have bootleg Pikachu on my head. But we've also got bootleg Pikachu on the screen, because I named my Pikachu bootleg. <laughs> um, Outlast, the first Outlast was, I think I did two, so the original Outlast I played last year, and I think it was two streams, but I don't think I did, I don't think I did five hour streams yet last year, I think I did like three or four hour streams. So I'd say probably like a max of maybe, it might be like a six to eight hour game, depending on how quickly you get through it. Alexa, I don't, Alexa, why are you listening to me? Why are you doing the thing where you're doing the, the blue bar that you're listening to me? Alexa's, Alexa's listening. Amazon's listening to us. I mean, they're listening anyway, because Twitch is owned by Amazon, but... <laughs> I don't know what it's doing, it's just... I don't know if anyone has has an Alexa, but it has, like, that blue line that lights up and, it, like, when it's listening, and it's just listening. <laughs> Time eyes. I was gonna look it up. Yeah, I'd say... I, I want to say eight hours max. It wasn't it wasn't a real long. Are you gonna do the DLC? Is the question. If you're gonna do the DLC, I'd say probably twelve hours. Um, I think you're the only one. I think you crafted it the one day, but I think that's it. Yeah, Banjo dumped Kazooie. Can you blame Banjo? Kazooie's kind of a dick. <laughs> if you don't do the DLC, I'd say probably six to eight hours, depending on if you if like if you get lost or anything. 
it's not it's not a crazy long game but it's also not a real it also depends on um how much you're gonna invest in like reading there's like documents and stuff you find depending on how how much time you put into like stopping and reading and kind of like examining and theorizing about stuff and then it, that that'll expand your your playtime too obviously oh come on you blocked my path uh uh, flannel source wants a positive message. Positive message, flannel. You freaking legend. You absolute legend. I'm still, I'm still shocked at the skills that I saw you put forth when we were playing some Donkey Kong Country. If not for those skills, I think right now we would still be stuck on that minecart level. I think we would still be stuck on the minecart level because you're an absolute beast when we were playing that game. Spending extra no I think we would have we would have hit the end of the section we've been like no we can't stop until we beat it and here we would have been almost a week later still doing the minecart we wouldn't even slept we would still be doing the minecart a week la later still <laughs> luckily luckily we were able to overcome it because uh, that would have been a real long a real long and grueling week can you imagine just doing that for an entire week straight? <laughs> how long how long do you think it would take for somebody to go insane just playing the same level over and over and over and over? How far uh are you in this? We just passed we just passed Brock, so we're we're not very far. We just started tonight. We did a a, a speed speed grinding sesh because we were really low level. I have this fancy feature that lets me speed the game up to 7,000%. <laughs> so we were able to speed grind. I didn't realize it accelerated to 3,000, 3, 7,000%. It makes grinding a lot less painful. But when we're when we're actually going places and doing regular battles, we're obviously not going to use that. Just if we get stuck and we have to do like really boring grinding section. Honestly, that probably would have taken like another 30 minutes to grind that out without using that. I want to get the team back together. We were we were really wrecking shop. I also want to get I want to get Bard in because Bard wasn't able to pop in last night, and I'm pretty sure Bard installed the game. So I definitely want to get Bard in with us. Bard! Bard was lurking. I hope Bard's okay. Bard said they were having a bad day. Oh no! I'm, I feel really bad. I hope Bard's okay. They, uh, they did pop in a little while ago and mention that. I really hope they're doing alright. Too. Bard's a freaking legend. An absolute legend. Oh, Kakuna, stop hardening. Stop it. Get help. You can't just keep hardening. That's not healthy. <gasps> Zane grew to level 8. <gasps> Zane learned horn attack. some levels. No, 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 Zane, Zane learned Horn Attack. Zane's a Neorian. Yeah, Zane, Zane leveled up. I've been doing the bait and switch. To, to get some of the weaker ones. Why is my name put? It was the first thing that popped into my head. I'm pretty sure I was thinking about the, the sound clip over on Billy's channel. I don't know what put is. Put is apparently something in Australia. Because Billy has this sound clip that goes something like, B "Believe in Pud, believe Jim in Jim Howard wants you to check out the following anime: Bigata H, also known as Yamada's First Time. Yamada. Is is 
this is this an adult is this an adult anime Yamada's first this sounds like it could be an adult anime <laughs> although this would not be the first time someone used the the movie card once to recommend a porno Yamada's first time I'm writing down I got a lot of anime I want to catch up on I actually might watch some anime tonight When you, when you put Yamada's last time, it just sounded like it was something that probably fell into the Rule 34 <laughs> region of things. <laughs> Is it? Oh, I had no idea. I didn't know. Maybe that's what that... Uh, maybe that's what the, the sound clip that Billy has is is representative of. I don't know. <laughs> Pud just popped into my head, so I was like, okay, our character's Pud. Our rival is Dad. Dad's our rival. I figured it was only fair since we had we had Billy as our rival when we did our Nuzlocke. So this time, Dad's our rival, and Dad's run away from home. That's our our whole backstory. Is we're trying to track down Dad. Oh, ooh, I'll definitely have to check that out. Sounds interesting. I mean, I, I'm I'm okay with I'm okay with adult themed. <laughs> Themed anime. We talk about tentacles in Rule 34, usually at least once a stream. Here we go. This is uh, We're meeting the criteria right now. We're hitting our criteria. We're hitting all the goals tonight. <laughs> you gotta check off those boxes. I got a little checklist over here. I'm like, did we talk about Rule 34? Okay, check that out. We did talk about tentacles. Check that out. How many times did we talk about glizzies? At least 30 times. All right, check that off. <laughs> we're doing we're doing a Pokemon stream. Did I make any jokes about running out of PP? Uh, oh, I didn't. Okay, I gotta make a I gotta make a joke about running out of PP. Ooh, I wonder. I bet it, it's probably not on Crunchyroll. I might have to I might have to venture elsewhere to find it. I might, I honestly might switch to Funimation for a month, one of these months, because there's quite a few series that are exclusively on Funimation that I want to check out. Oh, you buy it at Best Buy. Oh, shit. Best Buy's not messing around. Our Best Buy's really cut down on their DVD section the last time I was there. They used to have this huge DVD section, and last time I was there, it was just like one tiny rack of DVDs. We fighting Caterpoo. Go, Apple! Bring us victory! Use quick attack! I've really been I've been I've been slacking with my anime watch. In fact, I think I'm I was, I did manage to get all caught up on my on my one piece. And now I think I'm a couple weeks behind again. I'm also almost, I have like half of the latest My Hero Academia season still to watch. Pair of car, oh, I like that. Oh, I like that pair of cargo shorts. Hell yeah. Okay, we can, we can make that a thing. Just a, just a piece of toast. <laughs> <laughs> If you had a nickname, what would it be? Uh, the, does Orange... Well, I feel like Orange is kind of... I mean, now that I I know, I know your real name. I know your real name. <laughs> I feel like Orange is almost a nickname. Let me think, if you had a nickname... Hmm... <laughs> I don't know you! Yeah, that's right. You're, what, you're telling me your name is not... Tony the Tiger? That's not your real name? <laughs> well, now your nickname is Tony the Tiger. <laughs> I've just decided. <laughs> I've just decided that your nickname is, is Tony the Tiger. I thought that was your real name. His name's William Joel. <gasps> oh, I do know William Joel then. Oh, I'm going to have to confirm on the next Beardy Bunch podcast that I, I do know that who William Joel is because I had no idea... I had no idea that type orange. 
that type orange is actually William Joel. <laughs> I had no idea. <laughs> I mean, you you are. Oh, oh, it's Tony the Tiger. I thought you meant William Joel. I was gonna say you are a musician, so it's like same same ballpark. I like type Tony the Tiger. I like that. The piano man. The one and only Mr. Piano Man. Type orange. <laughs> Piano. Who is the lady laughing in the background? I could have sworn I heard a lady laughing in the background. That was the most startling part of that. <laughs> it was just the lady laughing. Done my dinner. All right, here we go. We found some grass. We found some grass. So we got Sandrew, uh, Mankey, and Spiro. There's our Spiro. Okay, Spiro's the mer most common. Like Pikachu! It feels like it's 3 a.m. right now. Probably because I'm gonna wrap up in a little bit, and I usually wrap up at like 3 a.m. <laughs> Type underscore orange underscore wants the following oh. Discord roll. Orange. What? You, do you want your roll to be orange, or do you, do you want like a specific. The Cat pa Panic Piano video. Oh. And I'll copy, I'll copy that so I can watch that later. Cat Panic Piano. Well, you want your roll to be to be orange? Okay, you got it. I'll set up. I'll set up your roll for you after the stream tonight. Let's throw a ball. Get in my ball. Type underscore orange underscore wants you to roll the Chaos Light Dice. Hell yeah. All right, Chaos Light Dice. Here it is. Just six sided die. I you got a two. What is two? Let me look in the Discord. I really need to memorize the the, the, the chaos dice redemptions. A two. Two resources. A two. Sunglasses. Sunglasses. There you go. You got some some sunglasses just for you. We got Spiro. Oh, Tiny Bird. The Tiny Bird Pokemon. Yeah, we're gonna give this Spiro a nickname. This is gonna be... This is gonna be orange to Spiro. Yeah, we got our Spiro. Oh, I'm sorry. Orange, you were transferred to someone's PC. We don't know where you went. <laughs> You're in someone's computer. <laughs> Get out of there! That is true. It's always bright when you're here, Orange. Oh, another Spiro. We only need one. We we only have we only have room for one Orange the Spiro. In our hearts, there's not enough room in there for for more than one Spiros. Type underscore orange underscore wants to name orange the next two. Pokemon. Orange 2. Alright, Orange 2. <laughs> you got it. <laughs> Are we gonna have like 3 million oranges? <laughs> and sand true but they're they're both only 15 percent chance
It's super effective. <gasps> Black Pikachu gain experience. I was gonna say level up. I got, I got way too excited for just gaining experience. Oh come on, give us, give us. I know it's only fifteen percent, but give us something. Give us something. I hate the fact that the Pikachu sprite is the only one that's not yellow. I'm gonna I'm gonna bring back movie nights next week. I've got a little a little catch up to do on on some writing. So when I wrap up tonight, uh, unfortunately I'm just gonna work on some writing. But um, next starting next Friday we're gonna bring back the the movie nights. I'm way behind. I'm way behind from uh, all the like the 24 hour stuff and the couple days after that that I was really like TKO'd and. Then the next day when I was trying to get caught up on, like, IRL stuff, so... Um, tonight when I wrap up, I'm gonna be working on some writing. So we will bring back the the watch parties starting next Friday. I also didn't really talk about it this week, so nobody really knew it was gonna happen. So I'll bring those back and starting next Friday. And then we're gonna do the... We're, I'm gonna try and do them every Friday, starting next Friday. Because it's been kind of hit or miss with various things, like the day before the 24-hour stream I didn't do one because I was trying to get everything ready and then I went to bed real early. Um, but starting next week, we're going to do watch parties every week. Unless something else is going on. Depending on what else we've got going on. Flannel! There's the wonderful flannel! Look, there's, there's even a link. A very special link. Favorite number is five. Ooh. Is there is there a reason? Type underscore that? orange underscore Flannel wants to five. name the next Pokemon. Flannel five. <laughs> Not regular flannel. We're skipping over regular the regular flannel and we're going right to flannel five. We could have just had a regular flannel. I've already named <laughs> all of our Pokemon after people, but now we're gonna have flannel five. <laughs> <laughs> I really hope we... <laughs> well, when you, re when you redeem a card, it, uh, it takes precedence over uh, anything I would have named it. Because we automatically get priority with cards. Because you used your card. Um, but I was already going to name something regular orange, so that's why I gave that last card back. But the next one after... Flannel 5 could be just regular flannel. Poison powder. Do we want poison powder? Uh, string shot. Get out of here. But yeah, I was even, when we didn't have cards, I was naming Pokemon after folks in the chat. But cards always take precedence. I don't think we didn't. Wait, did we name a flannel? No, we didn't. I don't think we named a flannel yet. The real flannel comes after the fifth flannel. Yes. <laughs> I'm gonna. I'm gonna take a guess and say probably next stream because. Oh no! Oh no! This that rattata is level ten. No watermelon. No. Oh. Um. There's only two more in this area. And I'm guessing by the time we find them. Oh, oh your birthday's on the fifth. Oh, hell yeah. And it's in the fifth month. Oh, shit. That's so cool. Oh, now we know when your birthday is. We you know when your birthday is, Flannel. We can, we can celebrate your birthday. Alright, we're speedrunning. We're speedrunning this.
Uh oh. Uh oh. There we go. That's fine. Oh, come on. They're all freaking Spiro. Why are they all Spiro? Come on! Is, is this walkthrough lying to me? Is there not sand through here? Oh no, everyone's dying. Oh my god, they're all Spiro. Everybody's dying. Oh, it's because it's level 12. Alright, we gotta. No, I'll just let. I'll just let the team get wiped out. Really faster. There we go. Oh, Mankey! Here we go. Oh no, <laughs> almost everyone's dead and we ran into the Mankey! <laughs> Damn it! <laughs> yeah, okay. Uh, I'm just gonna throw a ball. Throw the ball. Go! There we go. Yeah, I'm it. So wait, this is this isn't gonna be orange orange two? Is it orange two? Name that Pokemon. Orange two. Orange two the Mankey. The, the the beeping plays on the freaking oh, oh orange we don't have numbers. There's no numbers. Oh we can do There we go, orange too. <laughs> orange too is transferred to someone's PC. <laughs> oh, there you go, Sandshrew. Sandshrew, perfect. Beautiful. We just have to... We have to not die before... Hotline! How you doing, Hotline? Oh, come on in. Oh, it's Carl going down. Carl? Carl's not our last Pokemon, right? No, we still have Zane, okay. I'm going for one more scratch. Yeah, Hotline's here. <laughs> the Mario... You can't escape the Mario screen. It's, uh, I love the extended version. I really like the extended version that's on Blurp. You're watching Bird Up! Yeah, Lizzo style! <laughs> Suck my dick! <laughs> Hotline's always... Always watching. We catch Sand True! We did it! We got Sand True, the mouse Pokemon! Well, you better believe I want to give it a nickname. It's gonna be. Final 5. Hey, Yabu Bay! Uh, oh, we can't. We can't do Flannel 5. There's not enough spots. So we'll just we'll just make this this Andrew flannel, and I'll send that card back to you, Orange. There's not enough slots. There's no numbers, unfortunately. Uh, here we go. I'm gonna give that card back. We've got so names in Gen One have ten. I believe it's ten slots. Uh, I didn't realize there were no numbers. I think we did discover there were no numbers last time. I really appreciate that Hotline's been hanging out. By the way, Hotline, how's your evening treating you, my friend? Yeah, we gotta... We gotta get to the Poke Center without anybody seeing us. We only have one Pokemon. Watch out, lady. We're coming through. <laughs> Watch out, we made it. We made it. P 
it's time. Right, it's a cat. Oh, yeah. Who do you call when you want some pepperoni? I've never seen Sarah Nice Cats. Type underscore orange underscore wants to know the next Pokemon. <laughs> Barn underscore owl. <laughs> Alright, you got it. You got it. Barn owl coming right up. I have a, I have a sinking suspicion that Barn owl is going to be a Zubat. Let's see. Let's see who's in. <laughs> A magic card for 500 bucks. Oh, you better believe. Part <laughs> I will never find out. <laughs> never. There we go. Barn Owl, the magic card. Oh, that's the wrong. Planel, thank you so much for those 100 biddies. I really appreciate that. Uh, there's a hyphen, but not an underscore, so I guess we'll do hyphen. Barnell, the Magikarp. <laughs> I think, uh, yeah, we got, oh, we should probably keep... I'm tempted to switch out Medusa, because Medusa's fully evolved now. Because Medusa is a Butterfree, but Butterfree will be really useful against Misty. So maybe we'll, we'll keep it a little bit longer. Uh, let's switch out one of the Nidorans. We don't need two Nidorans on the team at a time. Uh, Zane or Karo? Uh, maybe Zane. And we're gonna bring in Barnow. In Barnow, sir. What oh, did you did you just unlock the sir emote, <laughs> sir? Just put it. Barnow's only level five. Oh, oh. That that's the only emote in my emotes that was personally made by yours truly. I made that emote. <laughs> Oh, it's very, oh, look at it, it's very brown in the cave. I guess they could also do brown, unless that's just a variant of, of red on the Game Boy Color. All right, let's see, yellow. We got Zubat, 75%. Oh, we got Geodude. We got Sandshrew, we got Sandshrew. And Clefairy. What's the origin? I just say sir a lot. I think it, it started when I was playing Cyberpunk. I'd be like, sir? Sir, you stay over there, sir! <laughs> and everyone just kind of latched on to the sir. I, it just it just naturally happens. I say sir a lot. <laughs> and I never noticed how often I said it until I started streaming. There's a lot of things I say a lot that I never noticed that I say until I started streaming. Flannel Source wants to start a prediction. Oh, what would you like the prediction to be? Oddish. I choose. Um. Right, here, here's our prediction. Ah, that's a good catchphrase. I like that. Start a prediction. Oh, why is it so? I can't see it. Yeah, I'm gonna do it in browser because I can't see it in OBS. Browser. Prediction. Start a prediction. So will we encounter anything other than a wild Zubat by the end of the stream? 
Um, and there is 10 minutes left in the stream. I'm going to run it for 30 seconds, starting now. And this is just wild Pokemon, not... Oh, Oh, it's, oh, it's too long. Oh, no. I'll take out wild. Then it'll fit. Oh, it's still... There we go. Start prediction. Got it. There it is. There it is. Cancel this. Get that out of there. <gasps> Bard! How are you, Bard? Bard! What did you mean? Um... Type Orange redeemed the card to name a Pokemon Barnow instead of Bardow. So now we have a magic card named Barnow. <clears throat> it wasn't me. I mean, I typed it, but there was a stream loot card. I, it was out of my control. <laughs> it was out of my control. Who are we fighting? We're fighting an Oddish. <laughs> <laughs> Bard, how you doing? <laughs> There's no escape type orange. You can't escape us. We know where you stream. <laughs> we know we know where we can find you in Animal Crossing. We got we gotta get we gotta get Barn Owl some some experience. <laughs> oh no, Bard, are you okay? Oh no. Oh no, I'm so sorry to hear that. I hope everything's okay. Boy Pikachu. Hold on. Hold on. Hmm. Maybe I should, uh... Maybe we should switch out. Let's switch out Pikachu. <laughs> That's not going well. So look at this athletic as fuck Bellsprout. I'm so sorry, Bard. I'm really sorry to hear that. Definitely let us know if you need anything, though. get to, like, relax and unwind it all over the weekend, Bard? Level 6! Oh, Bard now is at level 6. Alright, so this gave me the moment of truth for the prediction. There's five minutes before I wrap up. Will we run into anything other than Zubats in this cave by the end of the stream? Oh, it's off. It's off to a bad start for anyone that might have said yes. Oh, Bardow I hope so too, wants Bard. to name the next Pokemon. Ooh, what would you like to name the next Pokemon? It's uh it's gonna be this Zubat, hopefully. We don't have a Zubat yet. Type banana! Oh, <laughs> <laughs> I uh, I might not be able to include the the underscore because I think if we do type banana all as one word I think that'll be fit perfectly. Oh no! Oh well, it's not gonna be do that Zubat. It, I think we can do it. Let's see. One, two, three, four. We can do it without the hyphens. If we do type banana all one word, we can do it. Because you get 10 characters in Gen 1. Maybe it'll be this Zubat. This will be the the Type Orange Zubat. Or Type Banana, sorry. <laughs> I 
strongest Pokemon on our team and we're using our strongest Pokemon to try and catch Pokemon. This is this is just poor Pokemon playing on my part. There we go. Type banana, the Zubat. Banana was transferred to someone's PC. So I'm gonna avoid you. This is why this is why we're so underleveled. I'm avoiding all the traitors. Oh, I'm doing really well, Bard. It's been a, a nice relaxing Friday. I can I can relate with you. I've never had a cat. But they seem, they seem very temperamental from everything I've ever heard from friends that have cats. Like, they can go from just being the absolute chillest animal in all existence to just bouncing off the walls in, in no time flat. I am. Yeah, I'm having a, a nice, definitely having a nice Friday. Fridays are always nice, because they're the short stream... Which tonight I'm going to use the, the extra time to get caught up on some writing. And it's almost the weekend, which means I'm probably going to have some, some delicious Taco Bell tomorrow, because that's my go-to one. Uh oh No! I thought I hit the wrong button. No! No, I forgot Thundershock and learn quick attack. No! No! <laughs> I was smashing A. <laughs> oh good, we got a moonstone. <laughs> and I thought we were gonna we were gonna have a real easy time with Misty, because we had a Pikachu, and I just gave up our only attack. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we've got orange, orange two, and type banana, but no type orange, yeah. <laughs> I can't believe I did that. <laughs> I cannot believe. <laughs> oh, you gotta work on some writing too. Your cup is empty. Oh no. Uh, well, I'm in, I'm the in an editing phase of my book, so I don't, I don't know, like, I could definitely help with, like, motivation for you doing, if you're doing some sprints, but I'm working on more of, like, the editing side of things, so I don't know how that would work with, um, with sprints, because it's really more of, like, the detail focus side of things. So I'm trying to get trying to get the book that I'm working on all ready to go by early next year. I don't editing sprints seem like they would be a bad idea. <laughs> that that seems like, yeah, so writing sprints are where you set a time for yourself and you just basically don't stop writing until that time is up. Uh, a lot of folks do it for like Nano cuz Nano's going Nano is National Novel Writing Month which is going on right now. So a lot of folks will do, like, group sprints to do, to, like, try and get the word count up. Um, but sprints are usually more about quantity than quality, because you're usually just trying to get the words out. But, I mean, that's, that's usually what first drafts are all about. Basically, the pomo, pomodro? I'm... 
I don't... I'm not familiar with that term. Yeah, I'm not... I'm not familiar with that term. I'm sorry, Bard. That's yeah, a new term for me. I also don't want to accidentally pronounce it wrong. I cannot believe I just got rid of Pom Adoro. Pom Adoro. I can't believe I got rid of Thundershot. Our poor Pikachu has just been. It's like, we just. I just took Pikachu out at the knees. Oh, Porno Door. Oh, oh. <laughs> Porno Door, I know all about that. <laughs> oh, now I follow. <laughs> Boy, Pikachu is just living their best life. I was like, no! Although it is very on brand for bootleg Pikachu not to have a thunder attack. <laughs> uh, okay, I'm gonna wrap up here. We're gonna wrap up here. I cannot believe that we just took out... <laughs> Poor bootleg Pikachu. Poor bootleg Pikachu had no idea what was going on. <laughs> <laughs> it's very on brand though for it being the bootleg version of Pikachu. <laughs> yeah, I've seen I mean I've seen folks do sprints that are like they'll do like an hour sprint. Um I used to be when I used to do nano um in college, I was in a group that was like a bunch of fellow college students that would do it. And some of them are crazy. Some of them would do like hour sprints. It, it, it's on. It honestly can be whatever you're, whatever you're comfortable with. However long you're comfortable with, just straight writing. Because the whole idea is just to write and don't stop writing until you're, until the time limit's up. Whether you're writing like complete thoughts or you're just putting ideas on paper, that's the whole idea is just to get something out of your head and onto the paper. You like shorter ones, it helps you hardcore focus for like 10 to 15 minutes and then breathe. I'm on board with that. I like that. I definitely write in shorter bursts myself. But I also like to look back. So like I like to write like a section and then look back and read over it and make sure everything makes sense. Because I feel like that makes the editing process a little bit easier later on. But yeah, Bard, let me know if you want to do any writing over the weekend too. Because I will be, I'll be streaming tomorrow from 9, 9 to 2, 2 a.m. with Lily. We'll be playing Diablo. Um, but other than that, I'm, I'm, well, Sunday I'll be streaming too from 9 to 2. So 9 to 2, both days. Another plus to spring. Yeah, you can look back and you can make some edit. I didn't, when I first, so my first book, my short story collection, I wrote for, for a nano one year. And I didn't do that. And going back and doing the um the edits after because i didn't like i just wrote and i didn't look back on anything and they were all short stories so i was like okay i finished this short story and i just put it to the side um most of them i ended up just rewriting almost from scratch because i didn't do any editing throughout the process hell yeah hell yeah i'm way behind i um i didn't write at all friday not not Friday today, last Friday, because I went I went to bed really early, and I usually write in the later evening, like usually after I wrap up streams on normal days, so like two or three a.m. That's usually why I'm up so late. <laughs> um, but I didn't write it all that Friday. Obviously, I didn't write it all on on Saturday because it was here. I was, I was here for 24 hours. Um, Sunday I slept all day. And then Monday, I was, like, running around like a crazy person because I had a bunch of, like, shopping and, like, grocery shopping and stuff that I needed to do. That's why I wasn't with the Beauty Bunch that day. Um, so I'm, like, I'm way behind from what I wanted to have done thus far to try and get everything ready to... Because I'm shooting for, like, February, March to get the book out. So um, I'm definitely way behind. So I experience because sometimes your brain works faster than your fingers... Uh, that's true. I'm like that. I, I kind of, so, I hate the fact that, like, I'll think up, like, I'll have, I'll be working on a story, like, now I'm working on a book, but I have, like, four other stories that 
are just like ongoing plot lines in my brain that I know by the time I get to write them, they're not going to be as fresh as they are right now. But there's no way I could write like all these different stories at the same time. It helps you stop and reflect a bit during instead of writing a whole bunch and then realizing, oops, I forgot something I definitely meant to put in there. I'm I'm big on going back and adding details later too. Like, if I have a base idea for a scene, I'll write the scene, and then when I do the editing, I can fill in some of the blanks. Because a lot of times I think of, like, little details and stuff that I could have included afterwards. I mean, I'm down to do, like, writing. I didn't I didn't know that there were so, like, I know yourself, but I didn't know, like, Andrew was thinking about writing a book, and, like, all the folks in our community that are interested in writing. Um, I know... Brody. I haven't seen Brody in a little bit, but Brody was also interested in writing. I forget. Brody changed their Twitch name. I forget what their name is now. They used to be Brody. Brody Gardner. Uh, I more mean as in, like, the sequence of events. Let's make Dad come sprint with us. Hell yeah. We gotta, we gotta get Dad writing. We gotta get Dad writing. We can't, we can't let him... We can't let him, him and haw about, about writing. If he's gonna write, we gotta man, we gotta strap him down to to the desk. Dad, you're not here. <laughs> but we're coming for you, Dad. We're coming for you. You better watch out. <laughs> team, team Chili Owl. <laughs> we're coming. <laughs> And you can't run. <laughs> you can't tell us you're going to get cigarettes and never come back. Because we'll find you. We'll find, We'll track you down. We know you're going to go to Nebraska if you leave. <laughs> Jay Chowell. <laughs> Chill Al. Oh, I like that. <laughs> Jay Chowell. <laughs> what? <laughs> Jowell. <laughs> Yeah, Nebraska. We know you'll be in Nebraska. Hiding in the corn. We'll find you. I played out last too. I know how to hide in the corn too. <laughs> Jay Chowley. <laughs> oh, this has been a lot of fun. I like that we do just kind of like chill Friday streams instead of like having anything really crazy structured. Uh, tomorrow, we're going to be playing Diablo 2 with Lily, the wonderful Empress Lily. Um, Sunday's going to be all about Five Nights at Freddy's again. We're still chugging away at the at the Five Nights at Freddy's franchise. I'm sorry to tell you, but we're going back to the clicking on, on Sunday because I watched some videos. I've got some strategies. I learned something that I was I was misled on as far as night four, the, the clicking night. So we're going back to clicking for at least for a little while on Sunday. Because <laughs> I'm I'm determined. I tell myself that. I tell myself I'm determined to beat the clicking. But in reality, I'm just stubborn. <laughs> I'm just real stubborn. I won't let myself give up. <laughs> we should do a stream teams event where we morph two names together for their team name. That'd be really cool. I mean, we, we could do that for the... The charity event that we're, we're talking about. In fact, I wanna I wanna get a a message out in that because I kind of I kind of fell off the planning of that because of everything with the 24 hour stream. <gasps> Mr. Grim Reaper, welcome on in. How are you? You've arrived right at the end of the stream, my friend. You've arrived right at the end. We're getting ready to wrap up. But I really appreciate you being here. I always appreciate you being here. <laughs> yeah, it's just the 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 stream event is just us coming up with it. it there's nothing else involved. It's just us coming up with the uh, the morphs of our names. It's an eight hour stream where we just come up with as many different possible combinations of of mashing various usernames together as possible. That's all it is. Oh no, Orange, we don't even play Fortnite. We just we just come up with different. <laughs> different names <laughs> I am down for more Fortnite though 
I was pleasantly surprised by how much I enjoyed Fortnite. <laughs> oh, Bard, I would I would volunteer to be part of the team because there's not there there's nobody needs to be wished good luck. They would be they would be blessed to have you on their 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 team. Also, we didn't get to play. We didn't get to play Fortnite with Bard last night, so I definitely want to play some more Fortnite and get Bard involved. You've been here a little while, actually. Oh, Mr. Grim Reaper, I really appreciate that. Thank you so much for always hanging out and lurking. I really appreciate that. The other chaos. <laughs> I don't know. Orange and I are kind of chaotic when we get together, too. Like, when we when we all joined up, Carly was, was the voice of reason in Fortnite last night. <laughs> Orange and I were just kidding. We were like, let's let's all get separate vehicles and run everybody over. <laughs> that was the that was the funny thing, um, Gru. So this last night was the first time I ever played Fortnite, and I was just kind of fucking around. And like this, what was it? The second game that I was in, I somehow got fifth place. And then we had um, Orange and Carly joined us for we did trios. And we won three games in a row, and we were just fucking around. <laughs> yeah, I... Uh, <laughs> maybe we secretly have a gift? I don't know. <laughs> I thought I was going to do terror. I, I really thought I was going to do terrible. <laughs> and then somehow we won three games in a row. It took the, it took the man in the banana suit to take us down. That was like, they, they sent Special Agent Banana... Because they heard we were getting too full of ourselves. <laughs> yeah, well, I, I feel like that's a valid... Like, let them take themselves out until there's only a couple left. I can't wait for Among Us with all of us. That's going to be crazy. A giant Among Us stream is going to be absolutely off the walls crazy. Yeah, I don't. I I almost exclusively don't play anything competitive, Grim. <laughs> I'm like that's why that's why Billy and Dad get so mad when we play Rocket League, because I'm not. I'm I'm the opposite of a competitive person. I'm out here just trying to have fun. So when you get really competitive, and I'm just like, I'm gonna ram this guy into the corner. <laughs> just I'll keep him locked down here because it's funny to watch him struggle. <laughs> and meanwhile, they're trying to win. <laughs> Type banana. Yeah, they sent. They sent Type banana. How could they? <laughs> no, Bardo. That's not true. That's not true at all. Although I, a lot of times I feel the same way. <laughs> I feel the same way a lot too. There's like a small niche of games that I'm actually decent at. like Dark Souls games and Dark Souls games and maybe Pokemon games sometimes when I don't accidentally replace my Pokemon's best move with a much weaker move <laughs> it would be really cool to have different community games too with the event like 4 playing Phasmo, Dead by Daylight, Rocket League well, I think that's the idea is to do separate streams and then everybody's doing like their own thing. So like somebody could be doing like maybe Jackbox for one of their sections or Gardic Phone or something like that. I used to play to win being part of an old school gamer crew called the Barbarians. Ooh. But you left them when they started getting too competitive and just started playing more for fun and giggles. That's that's what I'm all about. I'm all about having fun. If you're having fun, that's what matters. It doesn't matter if you're winning. It, doesn't, it really doesn't matter. I know there's like a big competitive bracket to gaming. Like what? What is it? Um, pro, like pro gaming, that kind of stuff. I know there's an official name for it. Um, but eh, just to have fun. That's what games are about. They're about having fun. When you start taking them seriously, they stop being fun. MLG. MLG gaming, yes. <laughs> they stop being fun when you start taking them too seriously. That's when you start getting frustrated and... Like, little things will start to annoy you and... 
it just it stops being fun when you're when you're like making jokes and being your usual self that's when they're fun yeah it seems like it seems like we want they want to everybody wants to do the the teams be cool to rotate people between groups every hour i mean i'd be okay the only thing is i don't because i don't think everybody's going to be available for the full stream with the exception of like myself um billy and dad i think we'll probably be the only ones that'll venture the the full the full length of the stream if we decide on 24 hours but I'm gonna send out because I I kind of fell off the ball with it because the twenty the real the twenty four hour stream really did kind of kick my ass for a little while. There were a couple days there where I was just really worn down after it. So I I'll send that out as a disclaimer to anyone in our 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 streamer community that's thinking about doing a twenty four hour stream. Make sure you're prepared for the fact that the next couple days you're gonna be really worn down because you're you're not gonna get caught up on sleep in one day. If it's the date you said, I might be able to do. I think that's the date we're aiming. That's what I'll send the ping out to everyone to see because I don't. We didn't get confirmation from everyone if that date worked. That was the big thing I was waiting on is to see if that date worked for everybody. Um, but I mean, I feel like that that date could be a solid choice. Yeah, what is sleep? I like my sleep. I don't. I shouldn't say that. I like my sleep. I sleep at weird times, but I really like sleep. <laughs> Yeah, nothing set, set in stone. We can still talk about, like, if we want to do a different system. You stayed awake for 36 hours back in the spring, but you were not streaming. Well, you you stayed up, up for almost my whole 24-hour stream, Orange. <laughs> you were here for probably 18 of the 24 hours. <laughs> All right, let's take a peek. Oh, see, I'm the opposite, Bard. I mean, I'll, I'll feel like I don't want to sleep. Like, I'll go to bed, and I'll be like, all right, I'm just going to sleep for, like, four or five hours. I'm going to get up and try and accomplish things, and I'll just die for, like, nine hours. And I'll get up, and I'll be, like, really groggy and worn out until I fully wake up. I'm the complete opposite. When I go to sleep, it's like, all right, I'm, I'm not that tired, so I'm only going to sleep for a couple hours. And then I just completely conk out. Oh, I might, I might be able to join you in Discord in a little bit. I am going to get some food. I'm actually order some food. I'm going to get some food after, and then I'm going to start trying to get to work on some writing but i might i might join you in discord a little ways in because i do want to get something to eat anna how you doing anna oh anna i'm sorry we're getting ready to wrap up you've arrived right at the end of the stream same here i'm lucky if i get 10 to 12 hours in a week oh no oh no grim reaper i'm so sorry to hear that oh anna i'm sorry We'll be back tomorrow with Lily, though. We'll be playing Diablo tomorrow. Uh, let's hop over. Let's take a peek at, at Twitch, and let's see. Does, if anyone has any recommendations, please let me know for our raid. Uh, I'm going to take a look over on Twitch and see who we've got live right now. Let's see who we got. Let's get to the bottom. We got Ghost. We got Kali. Raid bar now. All right. <laughs> Is there a bar now on Twitch? Oh, Grim Reaper. We don't. I don't want to think about that. We. Nobody wants to envision a world like that. Oh, Drippy Lemon. Oh, Papa Bear Ellie. Papa Bear Ellie streaming. Let's see. <gasps> oh. Oh, my friend Link Ramsey. Link just came back. Oh, okay. So here's what we're going to do. Um, I've talked about Link before. Wait, no, he didn't. Did he just end? Um, Link was my first friend that streamed. 
that was kind of my inspiration for starting stream and he he had to he had some personal stuff go on IRL and he just came back to streaming last night and I missed his first stream back uh, and he is streaming right now so I will we'll definitely we can definitely raid Kali Kali Kali's got quite a few viewers right now um, so I, I really want to raid uh, my my friend Link, who kind of just came back and is just getting back in the groove of things. Let's yeah, absolutely. Let's go. Let's go show them some love. There is a bar now, but they haven't streamed in four years. Somebody's got to reach out to them. We got to make sure bar now is okay. We got to make sure they're okay. We got to make sure they're good. Uh, thank you so much, everyone, for for coming on, on out for our Friday stream. Uh, Pokemon Fridays are back. They're going to be in full swing until the end of the... Well, they're probably going to be in full swing, just... Pokemon Fridays are probably going to be a permanent thing, because everyone seems to really enjoy Pokemon. Um, hopefully, we'll be able to finish Yellow by the end of the year, and then we'll be able to roll into the, the Gen 2 games next year, which will be a lot of fun. And we'll, we'll probably switch over to Diamond and Pearl for a little bit in a couple weeks. It's going to be a lot of fun. The Diamond and Pearl remakes, I should clarify. Neither has barred out. Whoa, 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 whoa. You you streamed more recently than that. You streamed more recently than that, Bart. All right, I'm going to start the countdown. I hope everyone has a fantastic night. Type Orange, thank you so much for hanging out. Bart out, thank you so much for coming out. Um, definitely let me know if you want to work on some writing. And if you guys are in Discord, I'll... Uh, I'll potentially pop in in a little bit i'm gonna get some food grim reaper as always thank you so much for lurking for hanging out with us i hope you managed to get some sleep this weekend too my friend thank you so much again for popping on in i don't actually know what time zone you're in i think i know you're in a different time zone from me grim reaper but i'm not sure specifically what that equates to uh let's see who else was here we had hotline was here hotline if you're still hanging out thank you so much we had Lily was here, and Zane was here, and oh, I don't know what I did. Chat is gone. There it is. Chat is back. It's currently 4, 4 a.m. Grim Reaper, go get some sleep, either, unless you just woke up. Um, raid countdown is running out. You know the, the drill. Glizzy raid, glizzy emotes. We got those glizzy hearts just specifically for this. Um, and spreading positivity. That's what we're all about. I will see everyone right back here tomorrow for some Diablo 2 with our dear friend Lily. Other than that, though, I hope everyone has a fantastic weekend. Ten seconds to raid. See you later, everybody.